there with more. Life is strange. I believe. Oh God. Here with more. God is his manager. How does it sound? All right, cowpoke. Sounds all right. Cool. We gassy boys, we gassy boys. Okay. We're getting there. I gotta spread the word. Okay. <clears throat> All right. Well nobody's on the stream but for anybody tuning out on the vod i'll see how the lighting works in a second oh wait am i just wearing a you know we can't just wear a plain shirt for this you know yeah i gotta be representing something right now Slip in there. Have to have to be wearing something now, don't we? All right. Coke. Ah, shit. Shaking everything. Okay. Ah, boy. I'm getting nervous. There's a whole conspiracy afoot in this town. I right, continue. Let's see how how she be. Chapter three, monster or mortal? Because now we have some answers, but the only question is, I mean, so we're gonna go after Typhon, but like, what are we gonna do with that information? Hey, stamp. Oh, I changed up the wardrobe a little bit. Oh, we're all in on it. You guys are serious? You have a superpower? Oh, <laughs> nice. You're both fucking with me, right? Appreciate it, Shell, Shell. Uh, wouldn't call it that. I'm not so into calling it a superpower, but all the rest is true. Fine. Then tell me what I'm feeling right now. You're feeling disbelief. <laughs> Got a sense of humor over here, at least. <laughs> You're actually a little annoyed. You feel hurt that we didn't tell you until now, whether it's true or not. You don't like being left out. Got him. <laughs> you can't mask your feelings. Well, okay. Shit, read me like a book. Oh shit, the foosball game. You knew exactly what to do. Yeah. Guilty. I mean... You needed to focus on the positive memories, not get lost in the sadness. I thought it would help. It did. It did. Hey. Just warn me next time, okay? Deal. Never thought I'd have a freaky empath friend. Pretty wild. So... Any sign of Diane today? No. But she was in yesterday working on her laptop. Oh, it is fuzzy. You yeah. said she was afraid of something around Gabe's death. If she's covering up what Typhon did, I bet there's proof. I hope so. If she comes in today, let's be ready with a plan. In the meantime, I've got to finish my shift. We're on it. Let's run into working, huh? You know, I'm seeing some time to earn a paycheck. I'm seeing some fuzziness in the corner over here. Let me see if I can do a little bit of. Okay. 
<clears throat> I should fix it, I hope. All right. I should... Do I have anything new? Oh shit, all the posts. Oh, oh god. All right, lantern visual. Uh, thank you to so everyone who- So many memories of Gabe I didn't get to make. No. Oh. Thank you to everyone who attended the Gabe Chen Memorial Service and a special show of gratitude to those who spoke. I think we did Gabe proud. Do you remember that thing he used to do when he would get choked up but he was too embarrassed to admit it? I haven't cried since I was like 14. It's allergies. Don't look at me. <laughs> Gonna miss him a lot. Oh, Gabe. Charlotte. Hey, all I've decided to close my portrait commissions for the time being. I need to work through my backlog. That's fair. Well, at least she has work she's doing. No, it's not one enough to put this off. I should have to put. I shouldn't have put this off. Hmm. Last call for LARPers. <laughs> Those who haven't heard, I'm planning a LARP live-action roleplay for the afternoon of the Spring Festival, and I'm in dire need of NPCs. If you've ever wanted to try LARPing, this is a fun, low-pressure way to get your feet wet. Come on by the record, traders, and let's talk details. To Stephanie, did I ever tell you that I started a science fiction film? Of course you did, Ducky. I was fresh from Korea when the director, Dr. Mr. Julius Allen Shiver, spotted me in a hardware store. He said, Mr., have you considered being in pictures? <laughs> of course, I had not. <laughs> but in those days, I was eager to swallow every morsel on my plate, so to speak. So, of course, I agreed. The film was to be called Invaders from the Mechanical Planet. I believe I still have a reel around here somewhere. Should you wish to organize a screening, that'd be amazing. Ducky, I have genuinely never wanted anything more in my life. I'm down. Oh, jeez. Oh, the Best Black Lantern. Best job I've ever had. Not that the competition is super fierce. That's the bar I'm at right now. Attention Black Lantern customers. The Black Lantern is happy to announce that we have returned to our normal hours of operation. We want to thank you all for your patience and support during what has been a difficult time for many in our community. We look forward to seeing you all soon. And on a happier note, I want to give a big Black Lantern welcome to Alex Chen, who has accepted a full-time waitstaff position with us. Be sure to show her some love when you see her next. Nice. Typhon, oh boy. Reminded to all Haven residents that Typhon Mining will be setting off charges tonight at 5 p.m. More charges. <laughs> Great. Please ensure designated, designated, bleh. Please ensure designated danger zones are clear. Call our 24-hour safety line with any questions of concerns. And please take note of our revised safety protocols, publicly available on our website. Stay safe and have a wonderful spring festival. Of course, no responses. Yeah, the call line didn't work so hot last time, did it? LARP volunteers. Some of you still haven't synced up with me about your characters. Cutting a little close here, buds. Hit me up. Oh boy, Ducky. To Stephanie, I've written an extensive backstory for my character, inspired in part by sections of Wu Shanane's journey to the West. However, whenever I try to include it in this application, I receive an error message to the effect that I've exceeded the character limit. Thoughts? It's great. Left flowers. Oh yeah, good morning, Haven Springs. The famous rose card has been polished up and stocked with our finest. You can find it in the park at the sundown. Pick one up and present it to your Spring Festival sweetheart. Man, nobody's ever given me a rose at the Spring Festival. Oh, poor Hector. Dude, it's no fun picking on you if you're just going to admit defeat. <laughs> That's it. Wait, hang on. Who's been messaging me? Riley. Hey, girl, thanks for the drink last night. Great to just unwind with you. Let's do it again. Wait, hang on. Did I miss something here? Wait. Riley, are you Princess Shoo Shoo? You know, wait, what's going on now? So, oh, that's right. After the after the accident, have you been holding up? I'm actually doing pretty okay. You good? Drowning in flowers. Please send help. LOL. Random question: Are you Princess Shoo Shoo two five three nine? OMG! How? No, really. You showed me Shoo Shoo when I visited, and two five three nine is Alex on a phone keypad. I've been had. So you played Dust in Daylight? Didn't take you for a JRPG, girl. I Me mean, neither. I found it here and thought I'd give it a shot. Now I can't get enough. I thought I was playing single player only. You must have spirit guides turned on because I could see you wandering around the Port of Clouds. I'm stuck at that big scorpion boss. Nice. Look at that. Uh, what's Steph saying? Um, oh, jeez. How much talking is going on? Foosball. Oh, thanks for the LARP. Of course, I think he's going to love it. Hey, don't think you're done playing foosball with me. The rivalry continues. You need a chance to redeem yourself after all. Salt in the wound, Steph. Damn. All in good fun. I love to keep playing. Come over tonight. Sick. 
Alex, I'm going to start running a Tunnels and Chambers game this week if you want to join. I have no idea what that involves. <laughs> Sitting around with snacks, role-playing a cool story, pretending to kill stuff, and, summari and summarizing? Oh, I'm summarizing. It's okay if I'm terrible. You won't be terrible. Two, sit in our first session. We can play it by ear. You free tonight. Ryan and I are meeting up and wanted to fill you in on some of the digging we're doing on Typhon. Love to help. What do you think about bringing that guitar over to the record store and jamming? Like in front of other living human beings. <laughs> Just this little one. Help in front of other people. Maybe particular about a lot of things, but in this case, I am a judgment-free zone. Let's go for any time. Another jam session. Hey, they're hanging out more and more. <laughs> I ship it. Yes, I have some ideas. You're genuinely great. You have a gorgeous voice. Thank you. You're too kind. Maybe a downright lie. <clears throat> Ryan. Yes, after I talked him off the ledge. Literally. Um. Oh, there we go. Thanks again for everything today. I'm glad I could help. Do you want to meet tonight and plan what's next for our super sleuthing? Absolutely. Just tell me where and when. I'm glad that he is a good guy and that, like, he's over on the side now. We're getting a whole... We're getting the band back together. Hey, you need a break from the all, from the all the late night search. Want to go to mountain biking Saturday? Hurt, hurtling over dangerous terrain, so relaxing. You'll have fun. I can miss the front wheel. My ass still hurts. You handle like a champ. Short notice, but tonight is my annual viewing of this amazing nature documentary. If you want to join, amazing. Steph is busy for the third year in a row. I'm detecting a pattern here. Oh, is there a stuffy British dude narrating? The stuffiest. Right answer. I'm in. Now, I'm curious what Mac had to say. He got back to us. Thanks for the help, Chen. Just remember, I never told you anything. I risked more than just my job to talk to you. I hear you, Mac. Don't worry. Get some sleep. Easier said than done. Yeah, I knew Mac was too, like, obvious. So, like, he was, he's not a bad guy. He's just in this position now. Charlotte. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. What's going on? Oh, there we go. Your speech on the bridge was beautiful. Thank you for being there for us. Of course. Diane stopped by with the affidavit again. I declined. I wish they would just drop it. I'm sorry, Char. Hanging in there okay? Hey, Alex, would you like to come over for dinner tonight? That sounds amazing. Love to. Can I bring anything? Just you? Maybe wine? Hey, again. I'm a little worn out. Any chance you could watch Ethan on Wednesday? Happy to. Can you pay me in more of those lemon bars you made from last week? Want the recipe? I'm much rather earn them by hanging out with Ethan than actually having to cook. Good deal. Hi, Alex. I'm sorry, sorry, but I have to cancel our girls' night. I'm not feeling great. No problem. You need anything? No, it's all good. How many of the gummies is too many gummies? <laughs> oh, sweetie, try and relax. How many have you had? How weird would you be if I said five? <laughs> Did you have anything else with them? Alcohol? Other medication? Just snacks. Take a nice deep breath. Take a drink of Wawa and lie down on your side. Don't drive or do anything serious and it will pass. You had a little more than the normal dose, but nothing dangerous. <laughs> All right, thanks. Did I ever tell you that I think you're so beautiful? <laughs> Thank you. Just put your phone down and close your eyes. Hey, those texts last night were totally just a test. Did I pass? With flying colors. Ironically, flying colors are also what I see when I close my eyes today. And there's a group chat now. Oh, boy. So, um, okay, guys, I'm making this official. Welcome to the Takedown Typhon thread. Steph, fuck yeah. It's an honor and pleasure. Let's celebrate at Alex's place tonight. Shouldn't Alex make that proposal? Too late. Guess I'm hosting then. You two free down for more scheming. Have you made any progress, though? Sounds good. I'm down. Crazy idea. Let's break into the Typhon office in Denver. I've got it all figured out. I bet they have, se have server access there. We can find evidence. Steph, we're not driving to Denver and breaking into a highly secure corporate office. Boo. But if we did, can I be the getaway driver? Sure. But Steph, your license has expired. How do you even know that? Because he's a big loser? A loser with a valid license. You guys are killing me. Okay, I think we're all caught up. Um, yeah, because I already had Ryan's joy. I had his rage. Wait, I had Ryan's rage, then I had his joy. I think so. Did I? No, I had his rage, yeah, because he was upset with himself. How do I even start? That gold glow. The way the pain and tension gradually fell away from Ryan's face. And then the laughter. The private joy of the moment when Ryan chose to turn a dumb mistake into a prank. The trust he had for Gabe. The love. The certain knowledge that he could fuck with Gabe and get away with it. That Gabe would love him for it. I pieced it together. Found it in the clouds. The goose. The car. The grave. And for just a moment. Just a minute. I got to have the sort of relationship with Gabe that Ryan had. I feel so fucking grateful for that. This morning I thought I'd only ever know people through their pain. I thought I could live with that. If it meant helping people, honoring Gabe. But then, this 
joy. Like a life raft, a pocket of air at the top of an underwater lake. Everything feels different now. Shut up, Dego. Deeper grave. It's the night of the living geese, and now I've wanted for I'm I'm wanted for goose aside by the mounted police. Nice. Okay, we're all caught up. Thank you so much for remembering my birthday last week, and that Marco Esquanda tequila was excellent. You are welcome over any time. You best cook. You best cook by a long shot. Oh, you're you're best cook by a long shot. Who is this now? Francisco. Nice. Ah, Colorado tap water. Is Colorado tap water good? <laughs> Pe I'm penis. I'm convinced this is totally sanitary, but what do I know? Well, you just dig into the penis. That's it. Now, Steph and Ryan know the big secret. It is such a relief having them in my corner. Jukebox is doing its thing. Old Miller Amber, Ice Fish Pilsner, Double Spoke, Double IPA, Kremlin Bitter. All right. So there's dirty dishes around here? How um, did these bird oh. contests even work? Oh yeah, emotions. I, for, I always forget. Are you in your face, Ryan Lucan? I'm Birder of the Year, and your reign is finished. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Better not tell Ryan I had a hand in that. Uh oh. Oh, yeah, because I helped her find the bird. That's right. <laughs> How are we all feeling? Can I get any other emotions? How are you feeling, girl? Where are you, girl from Rome? Gosh, I really miss that song. They used to play it in here all the time. I'm playing Girl from Rome. I heard it. Maybe Jed knows where it went. Oh, can I not? Is it not in here? What are you feeling? I can't go on a run. Everyone will see how awkward and out of shape I am. Mm -mm. Forget it. Been there before. Maybe I can encourage her. Hell yeah. New dialogue options. Dope. Hey, can I ask you something? I've always felt too self-conscious to try running. Aww. You seem like a pro. Any tips? Oh. Well, definitely don't let that stop you. Just push through it, you know? Hmm. Nice. I'll try that. Reverse Thanks. psychology. Now, how are you feeling? Trust me. Oh. You're not alone. A. Now, how you? Oh, feelings. Oh, feelings gone. I'll take it. I'll take it. Dirty dishes. I wasn't finished with that. There are at least two or three bites of burger left in that plate. Someone come in. Oh, that was me digging into the kitchen. Okay. Jan? Is that a new city council notice? Will be closed on the last Thursday of every month from 8 a.m. to 11.30 for, oh, for town council business just in general. Oh, Jed's the town council chair. Neat. Song. Definitely the best boss I've ever had. Jed is the best. Which, to be fair, isn't that high a bar? Hey, where do we keep unused jukebox CDs? We don't. Everything we have is in the jukebox. Oh. Cool. Just curious. Why did you say the song was called again? Where are you? Girl from Rome? Girl All right. From Rome. Let's make this girl's night. Three sheets to the wind. All right. Girl from Rome. How ordinary Jews. <clears throat> Where is it? Where are you, girl from Rome? Is it not called that? Hang on. Was there another hint in there? Where are you, girl from Rome? Well, that's it. It's just the shit. Is it gonna be the picture? The picture? Like, would it be like Rome in the picture? 
Look, something that looks like Girl from Rome. Uh, maybe it's all I know. Words, hands. Hmm. What am I supposed to know? Where are you, girl from Rome? I, w I was saying, Boer, it still gets me. Is it? Meldred Cross and the Watermelon Frost Brigade. Girl from Rome. I have no idea which one it would be. Chi line transfer. It's all missing. What? Jed's such a liar. Jed, think of the children. Okay. Hang on, Jed. Did you trade out the quarters in the register yet? All you, kid. Oh my God! So I have to do I have to find the record somewhere? <laughs> okay. Well, shit. Where, if I were a record, where would I be? Oh, Eleanor. If I can get help on my own, oh. Riley never needs to know about my condition. I won't have to be a burden. No, it you're not a burden. It my heart that she's coping with this alone. You can I get feel help. terrible for Eleanor. And I don't think it's getting any easier. No, conditions like that are typically degenerative. Wait, that's hey, the Hey, Eleanor. Right? How are you? I'm doing okay. Thank you, dear. I'm not doing okay. I really appreciate oh. your help from a couple weeks ago. It means a lot to me. Of course. Of course. I'm glad I could help. All right, if I were an old record, where would I be? Steph and Ryan. Hey. The inductees. Gabe would be proud. Mm-hmm. That's great. Typhon Flyer. <sighs> <clears throat> Typhon Mining Company, integrity to our very core. It's time to change your life. Join the ever-growing ranks of the world leader in, ev in excavation, mining, and distribution. Typhon Mining Company is hiring both field and office positions, including team managers and directors. We're looking to build relationships with our communities, and that means giving you lifelong career opportunities that we won't find anywhere else. Sure. That's right, Gabe's Love plaque. You, Gabe. Oh, they made him a plaque? Oh. 93 to 2019, in memory of Gabe Chen, who came to this bar a stranger and left his, a fam left his family. Damn, that's a shame. A bomber. Rad jacket. I'm guessing boss man must be Jed. Hell yeah, <laughs> Jed's got a bomb ass bomber. I love it. Not to be a single issue voter or anything, but fuck Typhon. Vote yes on LBM 39. Local ballot measure 36 will create hundreds of jobs in Haven Springs over the next 10 years. Right. Festival flyer. The spring festival is nigh. Nigh, I say. Join us this evening in Heritage Park for the annual spring festival celebration, complete with food, drink, music, games, and more. But if, oh, Ducky. How you doing, Ducky? Looks like Ducky's getting started earlier than usual today. Your tab is in the six figures, Ducky. <laughs> Chump change. Let's make it 12. <laughs> Love him. Hey, Bear. Jed acts like he's in charge, but we all know who really calls <laughs> the shots in here. This bear's running things in the shadows. Ducky almost hustled me out of my first paycheck. Nice. Good thing Jed stepped in. I don't know if Charlotte was in here right now. Poor Amelia. Yeah, we've heard this plaque every time. So back from whence you came. No emotion? You're okay. Already got to verdant cliffs. Howdy. Charlotte must be getting ready for the LARP. Nice. Hey. Getting ready for the big LARP? Oh, hey. Yeah. Trying. Nice. I hope we can get Ethan into it. Oh, Ethan will love it. Are you kidding me? Is everything okay? Oh. 
Yeah. Don't worry. I'm sure he'll like it. Nah, you got something on your mind. At least it seemed like it. How's Ducky feeling? It's gonna be a long night tonight. Always is. Oh. Same thing every year. Tonight's the spring festival. I wonder what's wrong. Tell me about it, du Duckers. Hey, Ducky. Is everything okay? Of course. I've never felt better. Okay. Glad to hear it. Mm hmm. Everything's not better. It's going to be a oh, long yeah. night tonight. Always is. Well, hang on. Yeah, if I were a record, Same where would I be? Every year. I want to play the song for her. If I want to be, can I go upstairs? No. I better it... do some cleanup before my shift is over. Oh, yep, 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 yep. I don't know if I'm timed or not. Well, let me clean up the uh, dishes over here. Almost would be nice to have a little quiet, steady job like this. This girl, she's got... What are you two meeting about? She's hiding something, I feel. She was the only one on the bridge not feeling Welcome. the same. I'll be right with you. Get her. <laughs> hmm. I better check in with Steph and Ryan. Well, let's clear away the last of the dishes first. Oh, I can't? Oh, did I run out of time? Shit. Well, hell. Oh, I did. I got them all. Okay. Well, hang on. I want to find her song. Where are you, girl from Rome? It wasn't the missing one, was it? Think of the children, Alabaster Daydreams, Three Sheets to the Wind. Is it? Is it, is it this one? Jed's such a liar. I don't know. A bunch of songs here, though. Maybe it is the missing one. I was saying the words. Well, how do I find out where it is? I don't know. Hey guys, how's it doing? How's it? How's it? How's it doing? How's it going? Oh, the song. How about that? Hey, do you guys know a song that goes, "Where are you, girl from Rome"? Holy shit. Blast from the past. Alabaster Dre Day dreams. dreams. Okay. My dad used to Let me in. Let me in. Gabe would put it on repeat just to mess with him. Got to the point where he couldn't stand to even hear it anymore. Mm -hmm. So, what happened to it? Oh, eventually Jed pulled it out of the jukebox and stashed it somewhere. You could ask him. Sweet. Thanks. Now, see, that audio sounded different as if that was recorded, like, later in, like, a separate location. Hey, boss. Do the words alabaster daydreams mean anything to you? Oh, hell. <laughs> like brother, like sister, huh? Oh, my God. Fine. Guess it's been long enough. It's back behind the bar someplace. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks. Oh, it's hiding there the whole time. Nice. Okay. <laughs> Let's hear this infamous song. All right. Run it back, run it back, run it back, to back, to back, to back. Here we go. Ear, earworm squasher. Hey, nice. Hell yeah. How you feeling? Alabaster daydreams. Hey. That's it. How the hell? <laughs> Don't worry about it. Nice. All right, time to check in. How's it going, guys? Okay, she's here. What's the plan? Well, we have two plans, actually. But we're still workshopping them. Cool. Progress. Two is good. 
Good to have options, right? So what are they? Okay, so here's what I'm thinking. I asked Diane out on a date. Wait, okay. What? And she's so into it. She doesn't notice one Ryan Lucan swiping her laptop. Ryan carries said laptop upstairs, acquiring damning evidence. I don't know about that. Maybe Diane and I still hook up. <laughs> Not important. <laughs> Look, I don't know That's about your that. Plan. A lot of assumptions there, kiddo. Oh my god, please tell me you have something better. I do. Now to be clear, it's the same plan. What? Except I'm the distraction. Hmm. Look, Steph, I don't even think she's gay, all right? She's probably into the rugged mountain man type. All the transplants are. I don't know about that. Let's keep workshopping. <laughs> <laughs> okay, maybe these plans do need some more time. What? It's a simple plan. Literally two steps. You just need to choose the hotter distraction. I feel like Steph is better at <laughs> okay, distracting. You're the only tiebreaker we have. What? This is this is all we've got? Oh my god. What? I hope what this could have consequences either way. Alright, yeah, Steph. You you do it. Let's go with Steph. Badass DJ? It's a no-brainer. Sorry, Ryan. She's gonna be more distracting yes. anyway. In your face. Yeah, that's fair. Oh, Ryan. Look, <laughs> I'm sorry. I appreciate the the effort. But we don't even know if she has anything worth stealing yet. I'm just gonna try talking to her. Maybe I can get her worked up and read her emotions. I'll let you know if I need that distraction. Good luck. Okay. Your usual. Buy a drink, stranger. Alex. Oh, she's beer. Okay. What's the best way to rile her up? Uh oh, we're gonna rile her up. Okay. Hmm. I know Typhon's responsible for my brother's death. I don't know how, and I don't know why yet, but I will find out. I need to make her upset, agitated. Alex. I can assure you that Typhon is committed to a full and open investigation. We want to find those responsible and hold them accountable just as much as you do. Ah, uh, she the truth. <laughs> sounds so corporate. <laughs> Look, it's like a rehearsed dancer. She's got a great poker face, Ooh. unlike Mac. But let's see what she's really feeling. He was all superpower. Let me try and read her first. Mm. I should try reading Diane's emotions before we go any further. Mm. Anger. I'm sick of the lies and I'm sick of taking the heat for this company. Mm. She's pissed. Mm. If I can stoke her anger at Typhon, maybe I can find out more. Oh, oh, here we go. She's religious. All right. Religious. I see the photo. Napkins. A sticker. Stoke her anger. What's that about? Is that your niece and nephew? They must be proud to have a super-powered businesswoman for an aunt. I suppose they do look up to me. I try to be the best role model I can. Mm-hmm. And you're a woman of God. Do you belong to a church around here? Hmm? Oh, no. Honestly, I'm sort of lapsed with all that. Hmm. I do miss it though. Laps, but you still have enough to have a cross on your like house keys here. William Bloom, huh? Yeah, he's the best. Mm. Good beer? Yep. <laughs> Just sitting here do bothering you her. Have um enough napkins for the table? Uh, yeah, I'm fine, thanks. Mm. Integrity to our very core. What? Oh. Yeah, that's our motto. It 
It's a motto. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now I need to pick something that will push Diane's emotions over the edge. Gabe's plaque. Hmm. It's already upset. Drawing. A plaque? Look, I know you're not a bad person. But my brother is dead because of the choices you and Typhon made. <laughs> How does that make you feel? I actually want to know. Alex, I... We... Typhon is doing mm, everything we can almost. to address the situation. That's the truth. Okay? Oh, 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 she's bubbling over. We're getting through a little bit. 20, I need to push her over right. the head. 28 the stab wounds. Time to explore Diane's anger about Typhon. All right. Oh boy. Why does she have it the, the her window minimized? Hmm. Okay. Time to find out what Diane is really hiding. Oh. Does it fall within the tolerable limit? Well, as I say in the report, there's a small chance that debris from the detonation could... It's a simple question. It falls within the tolerable limits. Mm. Typhon brought me here, and look where it got me. Damn them all. Wait, there's something else. Seems like not a great company. Oh, oh, I see a flash drive. I didn't join Typhon to cover up a murder. Oh. If they try to pin this on me, I'll have everything I need to fight back. Oh, interesting. Holy shit. She must have evidence on the USB stick. <clears throat> oh, looks like I'll need a distraction after all. Oh, Steph! Why is Diane okay with me just chilling here? Buzz, buzz. It's time. <laughs> she's so, she's so ready. <laughs> oh boy. Steph, how are you? So, what's your deal? Oh boy. <laughs> I'm sorry? Are you single, semi-single, taken, but still down to get drunk and make out? Nice. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> was not expecting that at all. Oh, did I bet on the right horse um, here? Uh, uh. Am I blushing? I feel like I'm blushing. Oh, did I even get a good call? <laughs> uh, no, no, no. No, you're cool as a cucumber. <laughs> That's good. Oh. I'm so flattered. Oh. I don't even know what to say. Hey. Got it. No, no sweat. Just think about it. Get back to me. I'm not going anywhere. So did I pick right? <laughs> <laughs> She's like questioning her own reality. I say go for it. They're under a lot of stress right now. But you, a woman of God, with this harlot. Man, they really got. <laughs> she, I'd be flustered too. I'm not gonna lie. Oh my God, what does this Scooby do? Jesus. All right, let's. <laughs> Holy shit, uh, that was epic. 
totally insane. <laughs> My heart is pounding. <laughs> We're criminals. <gasps> Steph, there's a very real chance that you awoke something in Diane. <laughs> That's what I was thinking. <laughs> Wouldn't be the first time. Hey. Uh, well. You guys. Oh, that was hilarious. Oh, my God. Grabbed the wrong thing. I hope this was worth it. Let's find out. What do we have? What evidence is it and who can we take it to? Password uh, protected. Oh, boy. Guess I'm not surprised. Her grand... I'll bring this to Riley. Oh. See if she's willing to help. She's a wizard computer. You so. didn't press the okay to disconnect first. In the meantime, we have a LARP to do. What? Okay. Grab your hat and meet me at the park. And don't forget your guitar, okay? That was quick. Uh, keep the hat. Really? Is the guitar really necessary? What? H how can you be a bard without a guitar? <laughs> the bard's whole job is to musically regale people. Well then, prepare to be regaled. No. So, did you finish the thing? Yeah, barely. It took me all night. I haven't carved like that in ages. Oh, did you carve a weapon? That'd be cool. We're back home. All right. Phone. I need to grab my guitar and the hat that Steph got me. Wow. Um, Uh-oh. Typhon officially clears Typhon of any wrongdoing and death of local man at the hands of Typhon Explosions. Gunnison County Sheriff. The Sheriff's Department would like to provide a brief update regarding on regarding oh typo our ongoing investigation into the death of Gabe Chen. Mr. Chen's death has been officially ruled an accident. However, our investigation remains open, and we encourage any members of the community who might have valuable information to step forward and share it with us. Our goal now is to gain a comprehensive understanding of the events that led to Mr. Chen's death in order to prevent further harm from befalling anyone in our community in the future. Thanks for your service, Deputy Pike. It was, if it was ruled an accident, why are you still investigating? As stated above, the goal at this point is to gather enough information to prevent an accident like this from occurring in the future. Accident. Scare quotes. Yum. Love to lick boots. <laughs> Go back to your safe space. Oh, boy. With the left and the right back at it again. Please don't make me disable comments. Wait, there's more? Oh. We'll be closed to regular business hours this after. Wait. We'll be closed to regular business this afternoon in order to participate in Steph Gingrich's live action game. Hey, we'll see you all this evening at the park for the Spring Festival. Live action game. What? It's called a LARP, Dad. I knew that. I was testing you. Uh, SMS. Let's see. You guys are killing me. The plan is a go. Uh, distract, distract. Nice. Okay. Sugar Pie Riot, Brianna Lilac. Stuff was right. These chicks rock. You'll love them, I promise. Of course, I'm investing all my tips into expanding my record collection. I mean, yeah. Kings of Leon. Every time I listen to this record, it takes me right back to that moment with Gabe. Let's try to avoid... I mean, we're going to hit copyright in any case, but let's avoid it for as long as we can, shall we? I found some really cute photos of Gabe and Ethan on this thing. Chipmunk. Ducky's gift to me for finding his booze. Oh. <laughs> it's... Nice. Um, <laughs> it's... A unique expression of gratitude. Is that an actual taxidermy chipmunk? That's amazing. I know this is Ethan's copy, but... I'm level 73, and I'm not stopping. Teenagers only. Boy. I haven't beat Steph a single time. That just means I'm overdue for a win, oh, right? Oh, have a little shrine. I don't even know if I'm doing this right, but it felt like I had to do something. Hell yeah. I feel like I kept the hat in here. Oh. Only one way to find out. Life in Haven would be a lot worse without these two weirdos. All of the best friends. Gnome. A housewarming gift from Eleanor. Oh, nice. She said Gabe loved these little dudes. Oh, I gotta find. I though. gotta find the missing puzzle piece. To do. We're one step closer now. Totally not corporate sabotage to do list. Figure out Diane's deal. Maybe read her. <laughs> Check public records for Typhon accident reports. Legal ways to file a complaint with Typhon Corporate. 
Turns out corporate law is complicated. Contact private investigator. All three dudes gave me a crazy high price. Pass. Research other Typhon sites in U.S. abroad. Spy on miners in the Black Lantern. Do you want me to get fired? No. Use the dark web to find a lead hacker. <laughs> Couldn't figure out the dark web. Take a break and watch Nightmare on Elm Street. Done, 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 and loved it. Request a copy of completed police report. How does Haven feel about Typhon? Radio poll. Hmm. A note? Steph, I will murder you. Alex, Steph told me he'd be willing to play at our next open mic night. I'd wager it'd really help lo loosen folks up and break the ice. Can you make it? Nice. All the gummies. Wish I'd taken Steph's advice. Thanks to the foosball Ugh. game. I mean it. Also, only eat one of these at a time. <laughs> Shabby D gummies. I still haven't gotten you open yet. Must be a key around here somewhere. I would have pried it open by now, at least. Wow. Ooh. Steph is a rock star for putting this together. Hey, General, Ethan the is gonna flip. The Kingdom of Gaunt. Welcome, travelers. Today, Thanor the Monster Slayer visits the troubled Stoneborn, capital city of Gaunt. Can he dispatch the ravenous monster horde and save the kingdom? LARP Basics. A LARP, or live-action role-playing, is a game in which players portray their characters through physical action, using costumes and props to add to the fun. Safety. We're here to have fun. Don't hit too hard. Go for arms, legs, torso, backsides, front. Avoid hands, feet, neck, and head. Act stuff out. If you get hit, perform a grunt or injury. Thank you so much for doing this. It means a lot. Your character. Ah, yes. Alwyn the Half-Elf, a level 1 bard with 10 health points. Name. Un uh, attacks. Untuned cord. <laughs> one, uh, one damage effect. Magic. Healing Serenade, one health to you and your allies, or stirring him, doubles Thanor's next attack. Backstory, after the harrowing attack on the Sonvari Amphitheater, Alwyn the Bard has been a constant companion to Thanor the Monster Slayer. The two have endured many trials, and have recently found themselves answering a call for heroes in the city of Stoneborn. Oh, then there's Thanor, human warrior, one level 1 health, 10 health points. Stab, 2 damage, burning blade, 1 damage, and 1 fire damage over next 2 turns. Shield of Courage, effect, protects Thanor from next attack. Backstory, Thanor, the monster slayer, is the most famous hero of the Adderway Peninsula. Even the smallest child knows how he once felt, felled a valley bear with empty hands and hurled a spear into the beast of Wraith mid-flight. Entire cities have been saved from the scourges of darkness. Thanks to Thanor's unrivaled strength. Hey, nice. A Keaton's Road. Spider with Alley, Magpie Emporium, Swamp, River of Sorrows, Majesty's Summer Castle, Dire Wolf Den, and Coldweather's Tavern. Neat. A lot of effort put in. Me likey. Shoo shoo. Dire Rat joined your party. Nice. Uh, what outfits do I have to choose from? I might stick with this one. Blue. I must ask you a question. Ooh, I do like the darker one, though. You know what? Let's get a... Hmm. Let's get some stash, go stash action going on. Okay. On the bike still. Leave it to me to wreck Gabe's bike on my first ride. <sighs> oh, no. At least Ryan had a good laugh about it. I could go upstairs. Uh... uh... My weapon of choice. Well, let me look upstairs first, real quick. Is the hat supposed to be upstairs? We're gonna have a heck and sit and do some uh, contemplating. And my shift ends pretty early for a bar. <clears throat> Let's see. I gotta water some plants. Oh god, no plants are dying. Oh no. Yikes. This garden is looking gnarly. Windspin. I wonder how many times Gabe got stoned up here <laughs> and stared at these. Guessing it was more than zero. So far, Ryan is the only one that uses this. <laughs> Maybe I should just gift it to him. Not a bad idea. God, living up here would be would be incredible. You need a lot of help, don't you? Well, let's weed the garden. 
We know how to weed them out. Just pruning. Nice. Ugh, not much better. No, but better. Maybe I can clean you up a bit. Keep on weeding. You can't have that much going on. I know you're doing a full-blown corporate investigation, but... All right. Oh, cute Look, burb. Man, burb. If you want to live here, you need to do your own dishes. LOL. It's a cute burb. Empties. I haven't played for anyone else in years. I haven't moved those. That was a good night. Just can't. The wind or or something would have knocked them over by now, but I appreciate the sentiment. Wouldn't I want to weed this over here too? Guess not. So I just came up here to weed then, is that it? Um, I guess so. All right, fair enough. Gotta take care of my quarters. All right, grab the guitar. Wow. Oh, dope. <laughs> what am I, Joel? Okay, let me grab my hat. Bow, down, down, down. Is it in here? Huh. There it is. Oh, nice. Secret beer. Another one of Gabe's <laughs> hidden cans. Don't work. Why would you drink warm beer? Oh, the key. Person, half dump truck. I feel you. How have I not found that until now? Yeah. I don't need to know what that was for. The bard hat. Hell yeah. <laughs> oh, shit. The feather nice. in the hat must have fallen off. Uh-oh. Maybe I can find it. Is it in the, uh, the drawer? Gabe Chen. Gabe's last effects from the coroner. Oh. Pike dropped it off a few days ago. Guess I've been avoiding looking through it. Okay. His wallet. You can take the kid out of juvie. Oh my god, a lockpick set. <laughs> Keys. Oh. Oh, you're hot. Hurry up and finish your shift, love Char. Oh. One match left. Oh. I don't know why, but this must have been really special to Gabe. Don't give up. Keep it. Never know when you'll need a light. Or a plot device. I'm not giving up yet, Gabe. I better find that feather. Steph is a stickler for details. Well, let's check the drawer over here. I don't think it'll be in here, but I can unlock it at least. What secrets do you hold? You are not the father. Just a notebook? This must have been Gabe's. Make shit right list. Find Alex. Find owner of stolen Chevy. Reimburse Jed for free rent. Return Ernesto's Walkman. Donate to Lauren's Detention Center. Apologize to Vic. New bond for Kevin. Apologize to Zoe. Really apologize to Katya this time. Apologize to Ira and tell him you like his remixes. That's a long list. And I bet he would have gotten through it. Apologize to Oscar. Pay Mr. Walbeck for the Chevy. Apologize to that guy from the mall. <laughs> Write thank you letter to Lenny. Mail check to Mrs. Franks for the broken window. She moved to Maryland. Track her down. Write to Miss Henry at Buckman High and tell her she was right. Forgive Dad. Damn. Deep shit. <clears throat> Anything else? Wow, Gabe. Still finding ways to break my heart, huh? No. Well, if I were a feather, where would it, would it be outside? What the hell would the feather be? Hmm. 
Oh, there it is. Gotcha. That's how I feel. Fuck around, get trapped. Welcome back. Shouldn't you be Alex working right now? Guard, ready to serve. Time to head out. <laughs> uh oh. Let's see. SOS. Not sure LARP is happening. Ethan's not into it. Shit. Sounds like his dad is picking him up in a few hours too. Fuck my life. Any ideas? Let me try talking to him. All right. Let's go convince Ethan that LARP is the right way to go. More notes? One day, I'll stop being a freeloader. For now, I'm just grateful. Oh, Jed is such a good man. Alex, I appreciate your offer to start paying rent. Take a few months to fill your piggy bank first, then we can talk. <laughs> he's, like, he's like, I'm not going to let you pay. You're going you're gonna to get comfortable financially, and then you're going to... God. Jed's too good for this world. All right. Ethan, you must try the lopping. D and D is what all the cool kids are doing. That and drugs. Oh yes, sweet, sweet drugs. Sorry, where am I? Oh boy. E Ethan's going through it. Fucking yellow tape around his body. It's a fucking hammer. Sup? <laughs> it's like Spider Verse. To hey. Hey. I don't need, like, cheering up or whatever. We'll see about that, Sunny Boy Jim. Okay, so maybe this wasn't the most subtle idea, but... Hmm. Do it for Steph? Steph's been planning this for days and days. She really cares about you. I do want to do this. It's just... What's up? Uh-oh. Oh. Read his feelings. <laughs> Cheat code. <laughs> like... Everyone's been working so hard. And if I'm not happy, they'll all be disappointed. No, it's alright. For one, you're gonna love it. Must be weird. Having a bunch of adults pressuring you to dress up in a costume and act like you're having fun. Yeah. Especially my mom. She always looks so... <sighs> sad. Because I'm, like, bummed out. But I can't just pretend. I know. We all lost Gabe. But you're a kid. So it's going to hit you pretty hard. Granted, all of us, but... Then don't. So, don't pretend. Just be yourself. Or yourself with a foam sword and a funny hat. But what if I'm still, you know, not having fun? Then don't. That's fine, too. No one will be disappointed in you for being you. Exactly. All right. Hey, here we go, <laughs> my guy. I don't want to do it alone. You have to help. Me. Oh, I'm going of all course. in. <laughs> here we go. Hell yeah. <laughs> we activate the session of LARP. Just comes in. Bam, down, 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 down. Oh my God, Jed! <laughs> Thanor, the monster slayer. King of the castle. To the gods and all the heavens who've come. King of the I castle. I am in desperate need of a great hero. A Burger King Could over you here. Be the one? Please tell me of your exploits. Uh, there's a bunch of stuff. Maybe my bard can sing something about me. Oh, Wait. <laughs> sure. Throw me under the bus, Thanor. Uh, horde of ogres. A horde of ogres. That's a lot. Thanor slew them with a single shot. That's great. 
My goodness. <laughs> so, you must be Thanor's bard, Alwyn, whose songs have magical powers. Oh, Jed read up and did his homework. It sounds like you are exactly the heroes I need. My name is King Tabor. <laughs> the age of monsters has come upon my kingdom. Horrible creatures stalk the streets. My people live in constant fear. Not for long. But there's hope. An ancient prophecy describes three mysterious gems known as soul jewels that can save us all. The Infinity Stones. I need you to go search the kingdom, survive whatever's out there, and bring me back those jewels. Do you understand? Yeah. Hell yeah, man. Well. Yes. <laughs> so I thought. Good. Then you must go now. My people are counting on you. Very well. Onward there, young man. Should we start with the main road? Okay. Time to find some jewels. Hey. Oh, who's texting me? Shit. Uh, reminder, we are open. We know a lot of you have floral needs in the ramp up to the spring festival. So despite the event on Main Street, we'll be maintaining business hours until 5 p.m. today. Attention, monster hunters. This appears to be the result of some sort of extra-dimensional rift opening up and spilling another universe florist into our world. The Magpie Emporium will investigate. I'm glad you're having fun, honey. The Magpie Emporium arrived in the night, transforming an empty storefront into a fully stocked magic supply shop. That's awesome. Mortal residents are encouraged to come by and pursue our wares. Nice. So what? you're... I can pull up the character sheet at any time. Nice. Seriously, Alwyn? Don't you recognize me? Nice. Oh, yeah, of course. It's great. Um, it's been a long time since Carneris. Exactly. Those were good times, huh? Except for the spiders. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah! Get into the character. Gotta say, Jed's king voice is pretty convincing. Nice. All right, let's go. Oh, the music is even like la da da da. How thoroughly should I be exploring? Look at all this. How do we know where to look? I think we don't know. It's a true adventure. Oh. I hope there's more people that came out though, not just us. Oh, hey Nan, what are you doing over here? Hello. Looking cool. Hey. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, a scroll. Scroll of Healing restores you and your allies to full health, removes all negative status effects, poison, stun, etc. May only be used once. What is that? A scroll it's of a magic healing. Scroll Hell we can yeah. Use in fights. Oh, awesome. We should find as many as we can. Keep looking quick. Nice. <laughs> the sweeping music. Quick, ride on mount the ATV. I don't know how thoroughly I should be looking, to be honest. Hmm. Said the main road. Oh, what's this? Drinks, drinks. Oh, oh, this is all for the spring festival. That's what it is. I'm sure there'll be a big turnout for that. But not for our LARPing, huh? No. Too much to ask for, huh? Alright. On to the main city. I just thought there'd be more to explore around here. Alright, cool. I'll grab that boat over there. Oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> okay. It's a wolf. <laughs> Get him. Shit, what do we do? <laughs> we Fuck! Fight it. Fuck! Ah! Uh-oh. Oh, oh, what are we gonna do? Turn-based? <laughs> Hell yeah. Uh... <laughs> I love it! Um, okay, Alex. Um... Hey, now, back. Let's do uh, Ethan first. Let's go ahead and do magic... Your, no wait, no, what's your attack that does the burning blade? Okay, I want status effect, let's go. Burning blade! 
One damage. <clears throat> and you're on fire for the next two turns. Perfect. Alex, attack. Let's do my untuned cord for now. Untuned cord. <clears throat> One damage. <sighs> nice. Uh oh. Two damage. Uh oh. Ah, I'm still on fire. Nice. Okay, so let's do. Can I do, can I do self healing? Remind me, self healing does one to you and your allies. Let's hold off on that then. Let's let's lay into him for a second here. Ethan, attack. Because Ethan's attack is what is it again? He has burning blade, he has stab, and protect. Okay, we don't need to worry about protection just yet. So let's go ahead and. Uh, Stab. Huh. <clears throat> Two damage. <laughs> oh. Oh, wow. I was just overthinking it. Nice. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, cool. I learned a magic attack. <laughs> One damage to allies? <laughs> Better be nice to Thanor. New skill acquired. Class, your warrior. Your fire blast. It's magic. Effect. Three damage to enemies. One damage to allies. Nice. Oh, so it like hits everybody. Oh, shit. But it's good for multiple Let's enemies. This is great, by the way. <laughs> He's like, ah, um, What do you think dead. this key is for? Phone. Ah, woo. <laughs> oh, it's a serpent ahead. <laughs> all the all the boomers in the town are like, what the fuck are these kids up to? Riley. I should probably drop in on Riley and thank her in person. Uh oh, she was hacking for me. Oh, cool. Um Hey, I made Ryan tell me what this USB is for. He was being vague for my own protection. Oh, don't worry, I'm gonna try my best to get you access. OMG. No guarantees. Depends on how good the password is. Thank you so much for even trying. We weren't sure if you would. Well, you deserve the truth. Typhon's obviously been hiding something. Mac's still scared to death of them. Anyway, I'll be at the shop if you need anything. Dude, what if Typhon just starts taking people out? Like, that'd be some crazy shit. Annoy. <laughs> Sorry, Ryan. It was self-defense. Hey, buddy. How do we know for sure it's dead? Should we tickle it? <laughs> Stop it. Be serious. Oh, oh, sorry. All right, kick him. All right, cool. Okay, keep go, keep going. Yes. Let's go off the beaten trail, though. Hello. Let's go. To Another the scroll. Beach. I forgot to it's look into emotion. Right? Scroll of healing. Yes. On a school? Nice. Yeah. I don't know. Well, now, who do we have here? Hey. Howdy. Or the oh. monster slayer. And my bard. And what you up to, Thanor? <laughs> Saving your lives. There's monsters out there. Orcs and minotaurs and such. Be careful. I mean, watch out. Sounds dangerous. How about a dragon oh. with a candy treasure hoard, Ooh. chocolate coins, sugar pearls, gummy jewels? You should sell that at the ice cream shop. Yes, I love that. Nice. Mint chocolate See? chip for the dragon topped with fire cinnamon candies. There you go. Easy enough. There you go. Just be creative I'd about say it. you're on fire yourself. As a active consumer of everything like pop culture and whatnot, I'm very much up to like... I'm more, I'm more willing to buy something even more if it's themed. <laughs> like, I'm a sucker for themed shit. Oh, oh, what's he feeling? I thought Alex might have liked me, but no way I can compete with Steph. Aww. Competing? Like, for me? That's... Wow. Oh, I do like him, but I my, my crush on Steph is bigger. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, I like you too. You're a good man, but... Oh, damn it. Hang on. Wait. A dollar? What? When did I miss this? Huh. Did Ethan drop this? Uh... 
Ethan's dollar. I swung over oh, the a memory. Box. No way. Prove it. I'll give you a dollar if you can. I did. I don't have to prove it. I'm going to tell my mom you called me a liar. <laughs> Do it, dude. I dare you. Oh. Wouldn't he want that dollar back? I didn't even know that was a memory. I'm glad I backtracked for a second. Back until we found all three oh, I was going to read Jed's vibes. Damn, okay. Uh, I'm sorry, man. I like you too, but my, if I have to ship one or the other, it'd be Steph and me. So, sorry. Um, another scroll. One dodge. You and your allies will dodge the next attack. Got another scroll. Cool. Nice. Anything hiding by the boathouse? Man, they went all in with all these scrolls. Hmm. Out of the way, Ethan. If you know what's good for you. A jester. The black lantern is part of the LARP. A riddle. Uh oh. I know this guy. He's one of Steph's co-workers. Nice. Hey, let's hear your riddle. There are three, it is said, heroes long dead, fashioned into soul jewels, blue, violet, red. Hmm. What are their names? Do not be misled. How are we supposed to know that? Interesting. Oh, Maybe he's we happy. Can look for some clues. My man's having the time of his life. I can't remember the last time I had this much fun. That nice. makes two of us. Hell yeah. All right. Three heroes long dead. Blue, what, blue, violet, red? Is that what he said? Oh. <laughs> I kill myself till I'm dead. All right, where are these jewels? Oh, blood. <laughs> oh, what's that about uh, oh the tavern huh appointment slip looks like you dropped something diane every tuesday 10 a.m appointment reminder behavioral health take heed it is believed that a swamp troll has taken residence below the eastern bridge use extreme caution when crossing or better yet don't let's check out the tavern want to look in here where the blood stains are yeah Let's go in. It seems like more of the town took part in the LARP than I thought. <laughs> go, go with this tavern. Hey, wood woodworking like that's expensive. The wood burn shit. Try, just try buying some of that at the Renaissance Fair. Or festival or whatever. There was a signs of a struggle. <laughs> nice. Oh my god! What happened here? It's been a massacre. Fellow survivors, I see. <laughs> Ducky, are you a murderous gnome or did you actually. Uh oh. Who are you? Are you the bartender here? I don't know. Nope. Monster ate all of the staff. We'll have to serve ourselves. <laughs> okay. Uh-huh. Ducky over here. Do you know what this key is for? Hmm. Belong to Barry, the tavern keeper. That's his leg over there. Oh, my. Oh. <laughs> so, if you want to try all of the locks, I'm sure he won't stop you. <laughs> Hell yeah. Oh yeah, I forgot. He really got into his character. He got like an extensive backstory. How's he feeling? Oh, he's loving this too. I'm a genius for convincing Steph that my character should be alone behind the bar. All the drinks I want. Oh my god. Hmm. Stop, Ducky. Not sure how I feel about that. Excuse me, Ducky. Yes? Uh... You know what, let's talk for a second. How did you survive the attack? Well, I'm not proud of it, but I tripped an elderly woman. Oh my god. She had a coming. Stingy dish wench. Oh my. <laughs> well. Want to tell him about our quest? 
We're on a quest to end the Age of Monsters. So you won't have to live in fear anymore. Oh, right that's now. a relief. Let me give you something that you may find useful. Oh. Dial Thanks. dialogue options unlock the next item. I'm gonna go ahead and guess. We'll be meeting a snake. Ophidian chime. Instrument, bard, snakes within hearing must fall asleep. Awesome. I got a whole... My inventory is stocked. About that ale. <clears throat> I see you've poured yourself some ale. <laughs> Ned. He's like, yeah, you know how it is. Hmm. You can't be taking free booze now. I heard Barry the Tavern Keeper has a son, Ned, who's very observant. So, Barry's like a hundred years old? Sorry, buddy. We're gonna keep looking around. Good luck. What? That went nowhere. He's like, he's like don't spoil my parade okay. over here. Oh, is he angry? Alex is right. That I was just trying to have a little fun. Oh. Gotta pace out that fun, Ducky. For your own good. Can I just like make him happy again? You find what you're looking for. Oh, she's a, he's Thanks. upset now. I wonder if Alwyn the Bard would have cracked the tavern top twenty. Oh, for show. Sure. Oh, yeah, the warning. We're gonna have to deal with this, aren't we? The Did you see troll? this warning? The limbs, that's great. Trolls are ruthless. Tankard. Steph really went all out in here. It's great. Gotta build the world. The rolling bin. I actually feel bad for that person. If Bloody lit. Oh. was a monster and you only had your guitar, would you smash their head with it? Be honest. N no. What? Oh shit. Yeah, I couldn't do it. I love this guitar. <laughs> That's okay. You could just run. Also true. Yeah. Ugh. Rough day for Barry the Tavern Keeper. Music box. So gorgeous. Where does Steph get all this stuff? I assume it's the music box we're going to unlock. Wanted poster. This kingdom has serious problems. Lord Cravius ba ba Botch Botch Botchka? Gorum Dank Breath and s s Howl of Grave Dun. Grave Dun. Old paper. Oh gosh. I think Ducky dropped this. Uh oh, I'll give it back to him. Oh gosh. I think Ducky dropped this. Oh, do I just go tell him he dropped it? Oh, the bear. That better be washable. Oh no. Tattered Here we scroll. Go. Oh. This probably has the answer to that riddle. <clears throat> the legend of the soul jewels. Be Be Belen, Belen, Nira, and Dasis. Long ago, it is said, when unspeakable terrors reigned even in daylight, four heroes faced the great shadow on the Kellyan shores. For days, the battle raged until the power of the great shadow overwhelmed the four heroes, pushing them to the brink of death. There, among waves stained with blood, Three of the heroes gave their lives, calling upon an ancient spell that pulled the souls from their bodies and fashioned them into three stones of immeasurable power. From Nero the Berserker, strongest of the four, came the soul ruby. From Dasis the Cleric, weaver of stories, came the soul sapphire. From Belen, the illusionist, keeper of the old books, came the soul amethyst. With all three soul jewels in hand, the fourth hero took up their sword and struck down the great shadow, piercing it with light. Then, weary and bloodied from battle, the fourth hero hid the jewels away and wandered into the deep wilds of Rune, never to be seen again. Good little bit of backstory there. Monster Encyclopedia. Steph thought of everything. Nice. She's amazing at yeah, this. She's a low-key nerd. The best of us are. Arachnoid. Just in the middle of the D&D session. A letter. Guess Lawrence is going to need a new business advisor. Dear, dear Lawrence, I write to amend the advice I gave you when we last dined together. There's a no need to sell your business. I am confident the age of monsters will soon come to an end. 
I have it on good authority that his majesty's call for heroes was answered by none other than Thanor the legendary monster. Uh, uh, thanks. Bad timing. Oh, the bomber's gone. Sheet music. What happened to the rest of the music? Ooh, hypnotic fugue. Let's take it. Explore the environment, collect the clues and such, and use it to our advantage later. Nice. What happened to the rest of the music? Well, we have half of it. I'm sure we'll find the rest. Oh. I want to focus on Ethan right now. Good, good. A coin! Hey, currency. Nice. I like it. Man, that, that's, that's creative. Steph is like, you'll find this in the environment. Advertisement. Advertisements. House bard. Sorry, Steph. Alwyn is pretty happy with her current gig. Seeking a house bar to entertain at diner, oh, dinners, dances, beheadings, etc. Must be witty, perceptive, generous of heart. Black hair preferred, cute smile a plus. <laughs> Excellent compensation. Old swords for sale, C. Elwyn the blacksmith. Repel monsters with the secret blend of herbs. Only four gold coins for the recipe. Meet behind Goldweathers Monday at midnight. I only have two coins so far. Anyone else been hearing spooky sounds around the castle? <laughs> oh, Jesus. Okay, okay, okay. What's the chest here first? Someone knows how to keep Thanor busy. Oh, I'll do the music box then. Although, can I tell him that he left a letter back there? I hope you find what you're looking for. Same. Thanks. <laughs> I'm sorry. <clears throat> Alright, let's see. Ooh, the dragoon. Thanor! Did you see this? That's got to be it! Open up the safe. Bitch has got a lot to say. Ooh. It's one of the jewels! Hey, The gnome comes up, just stabs them in the back. Nice! I hope you find what you're looking for. One down, two to go. That wasn't so bad, right? Now I feel more confident we can find the others. Well, we found it one Why coin. Why do you finally there. believe in us? Oh, <laughs> that's not what I meant. Nothing in the chest. Okay, we don't go upstairs, do we? Okay. Ducky, any last words of wisdom? I was having such a quiet morning. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. Alex is right. But I was just trying to have a little fun. I'm sorry to upset you, Ducky. I'm sorry. Bye. Godspeed. Godspeed. Enjoy your free booze, Duckles. Godspeed. Godspeed, Spider Man. <laughs> All right. You said the recipe's behind the tavern. Check out what I found in that chest. Oh, one dodge. Nice. Nice work, Thanor. Oh. Can someone please explain why everyone on Main Street is dressed like a Renaissance festival throw up on them? The Age of Monsters has descended upon our fair hamlet. This is exactly what I'm talking about. Listen not, sir, to those who would tell you to abandon hope. For the great hero Thanor has arrived at our gates. What does this mean? I just wanted to get some ice cream. Ah woo! -hoo -hoo. Ryan, is that you? It's great. <laughs> ah woo! -hoo -hoo. Oh no, this is great. Someone's like, I just wanted to grab a snack. There was some really interesting stuff in there. Yeah. Hell, I told you so. What are you talking about? Ready to answer? I'll say it once more. Mm. There are three, it is said, heroes long dead, fashioned into soul jewels, blue, violet, red. Are you asking for the names? What are their names? Do not be misled. Oh, that is the question. Okay. Their names are... Oh. Oh, yes. Uh, Nira, Desis, and uh, Belen. The answer is Nira, Dasis, and Belen. 
You solved the riddle, you hey. told. Your prize? A useful hint. Behold. Behold! To bribe that deadly troll of old, oh. you have to pay four coins of gold. But I also have a recipe to buy. Four coins. Got it. I have two coins. Uh, there's more. Oh. Because you solved my verse, you may take one gold from my purse. <laughs> He's just rhyming everything. I wish we could go back to the tavern when it's full of people. I'll it, take it. Thanks. Nice. Three coins. Well, okay then. Anything hiding? Aren't I supposed to be the one teaching you? Hey, hey. Oh. What's all this? Too busy to talk right now. Oh. Sorry. <laughs> Knock him dead. Glasses guy. How you feeling, buddy? Ethan's back to his old self, thank God. What a great kid. Ethan's Aww. got a lot of people who care about him. Faux show. Ethan! Ethan Winters. Behind the tavern, I thought he said. I would gladly work at a place called Gullweather's Tavern. Same, honestly. Hmm. Fuck Tython. Can I go back here? No? I thought they said there was... Okay, never mind. I guess it was just, like, written lore, not actual thing I could find. If I can find one more coin, I can bribe the troll. One, I want the experience from combat. I want to increase my level. I think I already looked over here. Yes, I did. Okay. Alright, what else is left? Sorry. Did you say she stole your crochet needles? Hey, kid. You responsible for that massacre in the Black Lantern? <laughs> We're the good guys. Right. Of course. Nice. Your allies gain an extra turn. We're scroll like of advantage. Scroll seekers. Yep. I'll save that. <laughs> no, not a real massacre. Oh my god. I'll save it for like a boss yeah, fight or whatever. Hmm. Ah yes, no, the town square. Very safe town. Oh no, <laughs> his mom's worried. <laughs> hey. Go get him, Ethan. Benchman. I'm Thanor. Go get him. Nice. Everybody's playing along. Sorry, we're out shredding. What is this, the ice cream place? Oh, no, it's the ski ski and bike. Okay. Hmm. I bet there's something. Oh, my God. The Are they doing the, uh, the blacksmith over there? <laughs> Could there be something down the alley? Where's the blacksmith? No, they said there was somebody in the alley. Remember? This is boring. Dead guy. Yeah. <laughs> Excuse me. My dead love. Shh. They're here. Oh. Woe is me. Woe is me. Behold, my love has been slain by yonder river monster. Oh no. Where? Just down the yonder alley. <laughs> near the river. For sooth, are you forsaken me? Alas. It's great. Oh, I can't get a read on you. Where is this river monster? Sign. Wow. Beware of river monster. Really <sighs> yeah, right? Oh. I... Oh. Well, every time I think someone's done talking... <laughs> this man... Some kind of snake? This man is... is I guess... Is playing <laughs> every role. I love it. Get him! <laughs> Get that skater! Give me that shovel! Another gator! To fight it? Give me that shovel! Why wouldn't we? <laughs> Not worth it, doesn't deserve it. It's cute! I mean, it's kind of cute, isn't it? Oh my god, stop! What are you talking about? I had to give I had to give him a little bit of something. It's gonna attack. What do you want to do? The bell, the bell. Ophidian chime. Snakes within hearing must fall asleep. Pretend that's a low sound. 
snake's ears are internal, so they can't. <laughs> nice. I speak parcel ton, <laughs> bitch. Ah, <laughs> oh, he's the best. You're gonna make a great husband and father someday. <laughs> Can't get over the loot drops. <laughs> More loot. I was just kidding. Hi. <laughs> all right. Oh wow. Let's make some ears bleed. I got all the bard attacks. A horrid disharmony. Three damage. Wait. What's that? What? One of the jewels! Aha! This snake was guarding it! It's like a dragon scale or something. Oh, I thought it was one of the jewels. Maybe it's got magical powers. Let's hang on to it. Nice. Yeah! Our inventory's gonna be full pretty soon. Nice. The snake has that been vanquished. That was so smart of you to use the bell. Thanks! Shit. That didn't take long. Uh oh, lost one flash drive. I think I had it. La I last had it when I was in the lantern earlier. Please, if anyone finds it, get in touch with me immediately. I'm offering a reward. Rough. Hope you find it. What kind of reward? Do you have it? No, but depending on the reward, I'll try a lot harder to find it. Thanks. Uh oh. Is he still sleeping over there? No, he's already moved on. You know, there's got to be some scrolls or maybe a coin or something, huh? Nothing? What a jip. Come on. Give me something good. Fuck Typhon. I did not think I'd be playing an, act an active D&D &D session in this game, but here we are. I'm gonna I dodge. I got three right, dodges. Right before you picked it up. Okay. We're gonna hit a lot of combat credit. soon? Or? No, I don't care. I expect to have like, fought the snake. Credit's yours. Can I sell all my scrolls at the shop? Like, is there a shop? All right. At least they give us some levity before the hard shit comes through. Hey guys. No, my husband. Okay. Oh. We handled the river serpent. Thank you, adventurers. But you should probably clean up that body. Ooh. He's like, what? Wait, hang on. Are they feeling something? Nope. Okay. They feel nothing. Animals. Sign. Come on. Monster abundances are when you need apothecaries. The Due most. to an unfortunate attendance of monsters, the apothecary remains closed until further notice. Ah. Disappointed. I thought I would finally get to go in. Oh my god. Oh, to the silver dragon. Oh, does mom not let you in? The black. Where's the blacksmith? Where's the blacksmith? By the worst of the bunch. Uh oh. oh there. I hear you've dealt with the river serpent. I heard huh? you talking shit. More than just talk, are you? Oh, he's playing a character, it's really huh? Sweet. How many people Steph's roped into this? He roped me into this. Everything okay? You seem pretty, um, grumpy. I've forgotten the oh. damn components of Sun Silver. Don't suppose you know the composition? Oh my God. Uh, I don't think so. Um, if we find out, we'll tell you. I won't hold my breath. Hey. Oh, he actually is angry. Bah, what a thankless life. Oh. <laughs> Being a smith in the age of monsters. <laughs> he's really getting into Whoa. character. He's really into this. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. We got a regular Daniel Day-Lewis over here. All right. Let's see. Bo the bald guy. Hitman over here. Uh-oh. Let me guess, is he upset about all this? One, two, three. I control me. Oh, he was the guy trying to... One, two, three. I control me. He's the guy with the anger management this book issues. Is for fucking toddlers. Ooh, nothing like getting pissed off at your anger management book. He was the guy on the phone with tech support, I think. Damn. Poor guy. A squirrel? Aha! You think you can hide a shit from me? I'm a trophy hunter, damn it. Restores you and your allies and your allies to full health. Did you awesome. see this scroll first? 
Uh, no. All right. I bet there's something fun in the record store. I feel like there's going to be a lot more combat, but I'm not, like, hitting any of the... I mean, I guess if I didn't have the bell, right? What is this, Undertale? Can I avoid every, like, every major conflict? I wonder how Riley's doing with the USB. Oh, hey, jogger. Oh, is she actually jogging? That run felt amazing. Hey. I'm so proud of myself. Nice. Wow. Good for her. Good for her. The flower shop. Ah, yes. Mind if I duck in here a second? Uh, bard business. I have to, um, renew my bard guild membership. Yeah. Okay. I promise it won't be too long. Just gotta see how that flash drive's coming. This is fun. <laughs> In the words of Reggie, if it's not fun, why bother? Dear customers, Leth Flowers will have reduced hours of operation during May and June as we search for additional staff. Cuts from COVID, huh? Yeah, go figure. Congrats, Riley. That that gnome is still the coolest gnome in town. Sorry, Ducky. Welcome to the Gleam team. Uh oh. Could have done it without you, Nana. Did you mean to order this twice? Oh. So is she so she was accepted? Is she about to head in or what's going on here? Hi Audi. Hey there. <laughs> I could ask Riley how progress is going with the USB. Well, that's the whole reason you came in. Must be hard to find new employees in a small town. I hope it works out. Seeking cheerful, friendly staff to assist with. Hang on. So find the soul. So I still need to find the soul sapphire in the in the. Okay. So I'm just hopping in here for the flash drive for the sake of it, basically. A cool gnome. Nice. <laughs> it's the best. Oh, uh, let's see. Flower power. Man, small towns. Everyone's been going out of their way to congratulate Riley these past couple of weeks. Raffle. So Eleanor's donating all those decorations? Annual spring raffle. Take home a beautiful arrangement from this year's spring festival. Oh, nice. So all proceeds support the Haven Spring Historical Preservation Society. Let's see. Oh, she's not feeling any strong emotions just yet. Can I go sneaky sneak? A card? What? What a piece of shit. Hey, Riley. I got you a little going away present. It's from that chocolate place we went to on our anniversary last year. I haven't been able to sleep lately thinking about you out partying on your own. Of course I trust you, but there's going to be a ton of guys out there, and that makes me anxious. Honestly, I wish you would think about that a little. Call me from school if you ever want to talk. Well, yeah, it's a little bit guilt trippy there. So wait, is she is she in school? Did she go to school? Oh, the arrangements. For spring festival. These nice. are freaking gorgeous. Yeah, a couple of wreaths. Check. This is just so nice. Oh, dear Riley, you'll need a new computer for your fancy new scholarship if this doesn't cover it. Tell me and I'll write another one. Oh. Eleanor Leth, Riley Leth. 500 bucks? I mean, just for. That's, yeah, that's nice. Riley's like 300 pages in. Must be a good book. The Mascaron effect. An astonishing vision of the future. A computer. I. We'll definitely not touch this. Oh, wow. <laughs> Password checks. I mean, yeah. Password checker. <laughs> Seven-day trial version. <laughs> so her version of I'll hack this flash drive is literally like Googling <laughs> like a password hacker software. All right, sure. Aren't you using ExpressVPN? God, I took that bus here barely a month ago. Feels like it's been years. It's been a minute, kid. All right. All right, Riley. Tell me what I just went and saw. Return order. Sooner or later, Riley's oh, gonna yeah. figure out Eleanor's secret. Alzheimer's. Gotta love it. 
There's a whole tech side to Riley I never knew about. Yeah. They did, though. A lot more beneath the surface. Any luck with the USB? No, not yet. It's gonna take hours, if we're lucky. Oh. If you want to check it out, it's running on the office computer. I did. But don't touch anything. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Thank you so much for doing this. You don't have to thank me. It's the least I could do for Gabe. And actually, it's kind of fun. Hey. I didn't realize you were so good with computers. Is that what you're going to school for? Civil engineering. Or maybe robotics? Wow. It's a lot to figure out. I love it. Kind of crazy. Anyway, let's talk about something else. Sure. How's your ex-boyfriend? <laughs> uh, oh, no. That doesn't have an actual option. Uh, how, about, how about your mom? I saw Eleanor at the Black Lantern this morning. She probably needed a break from me. I've been nagging her all morning about getting one of those, like, medical alert buttons. Yeah, not a bad idea. <laughs> oh, man. I'm going to be four hours away, and she's never lived alone before. Yeah? What about Mac? How's Mac doing? I haven't seen him in a while. Did he skip down? Oh, he's around. Probably too embarrassed to show his face. He gives me shit every time I see him. I can't get out of this town fast enough. Okay, so she has to stay strong. Yet. All right, see you later. Let's talk later. I'll let you know if I make any progress. Thanks again. Well, I already looked. Is there anywhere? Is I mean, is there anything further to do back there? Is she feeling? Nope. Okay. Yeah, I poked my head back and I saw the flash drive, but computer. Okay, cool. So yeah, she's still running the flash drive. So, let's f continue our D&D &D quest over here. To the door. What? Oh, there we go. Ethan, sorry to keep you waiting. I mean, uh, Thanor! <laughs> Thanor the Great! Yes, yes, quite. Any more monsters to slay, I imagine? Perhaps. I wonder what we'll find at the Bridge of Flowers. Oh, I can't wait. I swear to God, if it's just Ryan again in, like, another costume, it's going to be amazing. I wonder what we'll find at the Bridge of Flowers. You just said that. To the Bridge. Any, any scrolls hide? A coin! Yes, the fourth nice coin. Find. Oh, five. Thanks. Okay. I can bribe the bridge troll. Yes. I've been looking for loot all my young adult gaming life. Nothing I can't find. Coins, scrolls. I see it all. Oh, oh here we go. Oh, uh, there. <laughs> oh. oh, Ryan is just pulling overtime. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Troll. They're like onions. They have layers. He's got a soul jewel right there. Oh. Oh. Oh, Bribe him. You like my belt? <laughs> it's made of human skin. That's great. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think we should do? Bribe him. Girl. Um, why not bribe him? How about some gold in exchange for your ruby? Gold. You've got my attention. How much? Uh. Hmm, how about, like, can I, can I shortchange him? Three gold. Three gold. Th that's it? I'll smash you to bits. What? No, I should have offered four. I should have offered four. No, <laughs> damn it. That's what I get for trying to shortchange him. All right, all right. Uh, what items do I have again? Scroll of advantage. Advantage does the. You know, can I look at the effects? Hmm, I forget what advantage does, but I was. I believe it was attack. Let's do it. Scroll of advantage. We gain an extra turn. Oh, I works too. Uh, okay. Ethan. Uh, attack. 
Let's go with the classic stab. Huh. <clears throat> Two damage. I'm gonna finish him off right away. Alex has what are our magic attacks again? Healing serenade, stirring him, attack, or disharmony. Let's do untuned cord will hurt us too though, but I can use a I'll use a healy boy in the next round. Untuned cord, <clears throat> one damage. Oh wait, no, I'm thinking of something else here. One more turn. Uh, let's do. Stab again. <clears throat> Two damage. Ah, I should have done the burning effect. And magic. Stirring him. Let's do stirring him. Get him prepared. Stirring him. Double Thanor's next attack. Okay, sure. So you go ahead. You rock. <sighs> Two damage. Uh oh. Okay. Um. First of all, let's get everybody back. Well. Hmm. Play it safe. Scroll. I have, I have a bunch of scrolls of healing. Scroll of healing. Thanor and I are restored to full health. All negative status effects removed. I probably should have held on to that then. Um, let's do Ethan. Next attack is doubled. Attack, stab, four damage. <clears throat> four damage. <sighs> and Alex, let's do... What is there again? Healing Serenade. Untuned Chord. Horde Disharmony. And Disharmony. Ah. Uh, let's save that for the next big encounter. Let's do Untuned Chord. Yeah. Untuned Chord. <coughs> One damage. He's got to be lower in health, right? Throwing rock. Uh oh. Ow! Two damage. All right. Ethan's got. So what magic does he have again? Shield of Courage? Oh, Fire Blast? Let's finish him off. Fire blast! Three damage to you. <clears throat> One to her. Ah, uh, the cost we, the price we pay. Sorry. It's okay. Worth it. <laughs> He's still kicking. Alex, quick! Uh, let's get you all stirring him for your next attack. Yeah, yeah. Stirring him. Double Thanor's next attack. Stunning. Punch. Oh no, stunning. Stun. Oh no! <laughs> right as I buffed him. Shit. Uh, let's do Alex's health, Ethan's health. Let's do. Can I do it on myself? Healing serenade. Plus one health. Okay, to us. I forget it was like one status. Oh yeah, that's fine. Double that's fine. Slam. Uh oh. Ah. Oh no. Oh, Mama Sita. All right, hang on. Well, now, now will it carry over still? <clears throat> yeah, <Four> nice. <sighs> He's got to be close, oh, right? No. Hey, got him! <clears throat> Damn it! I should, I shouldn't have cheaped him out. Four, four <clears throat> coins was the answer. I have coins though. If there's a shop. Nice. Sorry, troll. Here. Look what else I got. We need just one more jewel. Class warrior, strike of wrath. Three attack damage once per battle. Only one more jewel left. Does anyone know how long the play game thing is going on? Is there still time to sign up? It looks super fun. Sorry, dude. We're in pretty deep at this point. Enjoy the show. Oh, yeah. Should have should have gotten back with us earlier. Getting there. Fucking nerd. Okay. That troll was scary. I admit it. God, that's what happens when I try to be Nothing cheap. to admit. I should've just, just given him facts. should've just given him four coins. Being that's definitely Ryan under there, right? Sorry, I didn't mean to cut you off. Uh okay. Wait, what? Oh, I thought I saw something. Alright, let's get out of here. Wait, do I not go this way? Oh, okay. Where are we going? Wait, I have we have another jewel. What is there left to do? We went to the Magpie and Pork, Keen's Road, Summer Castle, Swamp Troll, Spider with Alley, River of Sorrows. What else is there left? Find the Soul Sapphire. Oh, well, it's got to be somewhere. Hmm. 
Was there something I missed, or is it something I'm going to hit up on the way back? I don't even think we can go this way. Oh, no. See? Okay. Oh, in there? Oh, the, uh... There's something fun in the record store. I want to help this guy out, but I've, I don't have the recipe that he needs, I don't think. She eats my fine work. Do I? No one. Sign. Oh, I didn't, I didn't so go in the record heroes, store. My bad. The worst of the bunch. Okay, let's go in the record store. All right, Steph's got to be in here. All right, Steph, you're Please the... Please <laughs> knock twice. I shall knock thrice. Go for it. Oh, boy. I can't wait to see Steph's character. I forget. Or have we, has she not revealed her character yet? Monster or mortal? <laughs> mortal. Come in. <laughs> I'm ready. All right, how's my crush doing? Because yes, if it's if it's an option, I'm totally shipping Alex and stuff for this. My shirt's giving off all the fuzzies. It's not good. Hello. Sorry about the lock. Hey. These are dangerous times. <laughs> Got it. Welcome <laughs> to the Magpie Emporium. Oh no, she's high. Oh. So, this is like a magic shop. Yeah, and I get coin. I'm gonna take a look around a bit, okay? Maybe it's gonna hold onto the coin. Okay. Look at that. Ah, she went all out. Let's see what Steph's done to the place. Hell yeah. <gasps> Folks call this a guitar. I'd like to try one of those bard instruments, please. You'll need to schedule a private appointment. <laughs> All right. I'll do that. A smithing scroll. Oh, hey. Sunsilver. We should tell that blacksmith. Oh, perfect. A semi-magical compound used in the forging of ceremonial weapons, shields, and crests. Once set, Sunsilver can shine with the brightness of seven suns, making it popular at coronations, weddings, and early morning council meetings. Components are iron, goblin ore, and fire powder. The discovery of Sun Silver dates back to the royal smith of Griffin's Peak, who first fabricated the great sword Weeps Weepsnow Kratos under the direction of High Alchemist Robert Well Wellborough. <laughs> like I'm I'm trying here. An, an, an advertisement, another Man, one. My dating life could have used a truth spell or two. Unbetrothed, to come to the Magpie Emporium on Sunday evenings. Meet other unwed hopefuls in a truth, in a truth spelled environment. Love potions strictly prohibited. Admission is only one gold. That's quite a set of good price. As a classically trained hey. bard, I gotta say, this music's not bad. Nice. Ooh, dude, she even got a tapestry. What the fuck? He's forging the Sky Sword of Power. Oh, oh yeah. One day, Thanor's gonna fight. The Skyward Sword, you might say. Dude, she went all out. This is great. That actually looks legit. Yeah, I've got a bone to pick with you. <laughs> oh, God. Golems. 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 Animation fee not included. <laughs> oh, Steph. Nice. Spells. Spells. Very cute, Steph. I like it. Spells for sale? To members of the Sorcery Guild only. Sorry. Oh, pardon me. Tarot card? Oh. Seeking, Seeking insight? insight? Draw a card. Huh. Oh, sure. Mercury's in... And what, vacation? Is that what they say? Retrograde vacation? There we go. <laughs> what do I want insight about? Oh, boy. Give me insight into... People. Um... Me. Uh, What? The lovers, a card of necessary choices, equal temptations and divergent paths. So it's going to make me choose between, like, either fall in love with Steph or Ryan. Okay. Um, Thanes. My power. Chaos and destruction. Oh. Yeah. Revelation no of shit. escape. Okay, what else is there? Let's do another thing. Let's do Typhon. Holy shit. The devil. Too real. Power and domination in the pursuit of same people how about Steph 
Steph is just awesome. The Fool, a card of spontaneity, fearlessness, and adventures welcomed gladly. Interesting. Ryan? Is that true for Ryan? The Star? I hope so. Of course! Inspiration, optimism, and hope for the future. What else do we have left? Things? Haven. Yikes. Death, a card of endings, inevitable transformation, and letting go. That's not really great. <laughs> Valkyrie, hey, you're just chilling Warning. in the corner. Uh oh. Cat is cursed. Do not pet. What if I also want to yeah. be cursed? No need to warn me. He said, meow, say meow. Gonna put a spell on you. A guitar. I guess some heroes are into bards with flashy guitars, but I'm glad Thanor has better taste. Widely believed to be the instrument of Fleet Silverton, bard of champions and savior of Prince Clarderin. Priceless or best offer. <laughs> uh, no feelings, huh? Valkyrie's dish. It's a wonder Valkyrie's ever hungry. What with all the human flesh I assume she consumes. <laughs> Magical ways. Well, I must. I must see. Holy shit! Yeah, my girl. Steph looks fantastic. Went all out. It makes me miss the Renaissance Festival. The streets used to be full of people. <laughs> Indeed, <laughs> she's even talking like an NPC. <gasps> oh, I see that. There's I a bet stone. We're supposed to buy something here. Well, no shit. Can I trade? Sell? The soul sapphire's right there. 10,000 gold. Sale. Troll dust. Oh, I could have bought the troll dust first. Oh, get out of here with this. I am the only vendor of magical items in the kingdom. Oh. 10,000 gold? Okay. Obviously, there's some other way to get this. How might I... Uh, let's see. Why is this 10,000 gold? Was I too generous? It was originally 20,000, but... <laughs> no, I meant... Mm. Never mind. Let's see, scroll of advantage. Maybe we can make some kind of deal with her. What are you thinking? Troll dust. Do you think we'll run into any more trolls? I doubt it. They're pretty territorial. No need to buy troll dust, then. Then I guess we don't need this. Humbleness, scroll of healing. How much do all these cost? One gold, one gold. I have five gold. Should I save it? Why not? Can we discuss things at least? Haggle? Oh my god. Would you consider giving us that sapphire? For my hand in... Oh, how about that? In exchange for something far more valuable. Oh, Alex, you play... Okay, okay. <laughs> we... hand. In marriage. Ooh. And... All of its associated benefits. <laughs> uh, <laughs> he got you? her. Oh, shit, she's. Oh a... man, this just got real. She, she's getting <laughs> flustered. I'd be lying if I said I wasn't intrigued. Oh. But I'm afraid I can't accept. Oh. No. <laughs> Yo, girl, what that D12 do? <laughs> Ooh, we need the sapphire right eyes. away. It's for a quest to end the age of monsters. We're here of mutual uh, stuff to do, you know. <laughs> Sorry, I've I lost heard. the words. There's a magical fish that lives in the river of sorrows. A magical fish, yeah. Bring me back one of its scales. What? And I'll give you the sapphire in return. I, I, I already did. One magic fish scale. Got him. Impressive. <laughs> well, then here's my end of the bargain. Well, that was easy. I have your stone. I need it. I need those stones. Got it. Cool. Should I buy? I mean, I have plenty of spells already. I mean, We've got oh. all three. We can go back to the king now. Yep. Oh, she's feeling a certain way. Let me read that in a second. Uh, what do I have? I have three nimble, two heals. Um, I mean, I, I got what five coins. 
Uh, let's, for the sake of it, go ahead and get... I don't know if I'll need it, but let's get a... Discuss. Let's get a... Mm, scroll of healing. So, I can heal already with my music. Yeah, true, true, yeah. true. Yeah. But the scroll heals us completely. And it cures poison and stuff like that. Let's at least do the scroll of advantage so we have, like, an extra move just in case. I like the scroll of advantage. It's kind of Thanor style. It really do be, though. One gold, please. Got him. Not <laughs> the coin drop. Nice. How's she feeling, huh? When Alex said I'm hot, did she mean it? Or was she just messing around? Never seen Steph feel this way before. Yeah, because she's you always so confident. Yeah, because she has a crush on you, dude. Shit, sorry, I'm just trying to check something. There we go. All right. Cool, let's get, uh, that's about all there is to it. Steph looks fantastic. Oh no, she's hot! Yeah, I've already done that one before. I hope we meet again. Nice. Alright, let's go get the the, the uh, blacksmith his uh, his stuff. So many scrolls I never ended up using. Granted, we're not at the end of our quest yet, but I feel like we're, we're approaching the end. All right, blacksmith, let's chat. Hey, buddy. Hey, we found the components of sun silver. It's iron, goblin ore, and fire powder. Praise the gods. Of course. How could I forget? Well, forget indeed. Why don't you take that scroll for your kindness? I've no need of it. Sure. Another scroll of advantage? Oh, I could have just saved the money. Okay. Stocking up on scrolls. Yes, sir. Not angry anymore. <laughs> nice. All right, back to the king. I think we've done everything we can in the meantime. Whatever that the monsters seemed so long ago. Hey, glasses guy. I feel like there might have been an... I feel like there's at least one memory I've probably missed somewhere. I got the dollar, but there's got to be something else. Oh. Hey. <laughs> How's it oh going? Oh my god. It's my mom. <laughs> Thanor, the monster slayer. You've come at last. Do you remember me from your past adventures? How could I forget? You're Netheria, the forest spirit. You have done well on your quest. The forest notices. She offers a treasure for you to claim. Look, there. Your first sip of whiskey. Oh, the sword. Hey. Hell yeah. So. <laughs> oh. Under the old oak tree. A sky sword. <laughs> nice. It's the sky sword of power. It's exactly the same as I drew in the comics. It's got the pincer. And the same grip. And it's got this part for the jewels. How do they do it? Magic. Craftsmanship. Can I really take it? Use it for good. Promise me you'll only use it for good. Helping others and stuff like that. 
Okay. Damn. Straight up dropped his old sword. At least sell the old one. Come on. Use it for crafting? I don't know. Hey. Put the jewels in. <laughs> Thanos over here. <laughs> With this sword, reality can be whatever I want! Hell yeah. It's better than drugs, Jimmy. <laughs> Fucking... Hell yeah. Oh. Oh, wow. <laughs> awesome. Whoa. Oh, do you think because his feelings about this are so strong, I'm seeing what he's, like, imagining? That's awesome. Dude, that's rad. <laughs> that's great. The power! <laughs> nice. Ah, yes. Thanor the Great. Who shall we conquer next? Bard, a song, if you please. Oh, boy. Please give me, like, guitar hero shit right now. I'll sing you a song. Prophecies fulfilled? Uh, sure. The prophecies fulfilled at last. Now Thanor's might is unsurpassed. Nice. <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> Ryan's back. Final boss fight. You fools! <laughs> That's great. Power of imagination, folks. Dude, I'm getting shivers. This is great. Oh no, the king! Cravius was the king all along. Or he's just, he's just double dipping I'll rolls. I'll take that sword now. And the jewels! What? We'll Cravius, see about that. Lord of the Underworld! I should have known King Tabor was you all along! Oh, it was. You fools! You have collected the jewels I need uh. and brought them right to me! Oh. Defy Cravius, encourage Thanor. Hmm. We've gotten this far. We can beat him. We got this. Give them to me! Uh oh. Oh, here we go. All right. Now I think I'll, let's make sure we're fully healed before getting into this. He's probably got some stronger attacks. Oh, even the music. Oh shit, Cravius, Lord of the Underworld. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's great. Ah, oh, yes, quick. Uh, I don't know. Um, let's. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Let's be real about this. Scroll of advantage first. Scroll of advantage. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I love it. Wham, wham. All right. Uh, attack. Um. A strike of wrath! Strike of wrath! Oh, nice. Hell yeah. All your attacks out the gate. All win. Let's use. Stirring him! <laughs> nice. Quick, Thanor! Quick! Uh, what magic do you have again? Fire blast. Attack. Attack. Burning blade. Burning blade? Yeah. Burning blade! Nice. Oh, he's got a lot of health. Oh, shit. Um. Ba -ba -ba. Let's just be, play it safe here. Healing serenade. I love it. Uh oh. Oh, no. Ugh. Curse this fire! What, is it also doing damage to him? Okay. Let's do... Scroll of... Scroll Give me... of advantage. Yeah, for sure. Give me a couple turns here, huh? Thanor, use your attack! Uh, what magic do you have again? Fire blast. 
shield of courage. Uh, let's do... Whoops, my bad. Burning blade. Burning blade. Nice. And use your... Let's just do Horrid Disharmony. Disharmony. Right? Horrid Disharmony. Oh. Awesome. And let's play it... Let's play it safe. Scroll of Healing. Hell yeah. Oh, I can't use any more items right now. Uh, let's do... Shield of Courage. Hang on, let me make sure he's protected for an attack. Uh, burning Blade, Stab. Fire Blast. Fire Blast! Ow! Well, he is Flame, so I don't know if he has, like, uh... If he has resistance to flame. Stirring him. I think we're gonna be okay. Ring of fire. Uh, uh oh. Uh, curse this fire. <laughs> Oh, he'll be okay. I think he's locked out of uh, t an attack, though. Hmm. Let me just do Scroll, scroll of, nimbleness. of Nimbleness. At least for me. Oh? Oh, just a scroll in general. Okay. Um. Yeah. Untuned Core. I summon the fury of hell! Uh-oh. Death to all who defy me! Oh my god, the veins. No. Oh! Ah! <laughs> nice! Uh, curse, curse this fire. fire! We dodged it, though. Alright, let's finish him off! Uh... Scroll nimbleness. Of nimbleness. Just to be on the safe side. In case it's next to, to attacks, don't don't and, uh, do it. But this should double the attack, right? Mm. Oh. Nice. Oh, did I do it? Nice. No! Get down! Don't look at the light. Nice. Final boss has been. <laughs> Hell we yeah! Did it. I can't believe what just happened. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love it. He's so into it. Epic. That last fight was epic. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but the best part was finding. Uh oh. Another blast. Oh, P PTSD. Oh, no. Shit. Oh, Gabe's no. Dead. Gabe's dead because of me. It's my fault. I killed Gabe. I killed Gabe. I killed Gabe. Ethan? Oh. I got him. Come on. Let's see if we can talk him out of this one. Listen to me. It wasn't your fault at all. It wasn't. Okay. It wasn't. No. <laughs> he was he was having such a good time too. Damn. That's a shame. Got straight up triggered. Oh fuck, man. It was a good time though. <laughs> well, it lasted. Do PTS be like that, though? Shit. Well, thanks everyone for coming out. Charlotte? Back here. Oh. Oh, nice. 
Oh, that's right. Obviously. Yeah, she said she does commissions. Trying to catch up. I can't do what she does. I, I can't draw or make 3D hey. art. I can make digital art. Thanks for coming. I can, like, direct of course. shit, but... Ethan's dad already pick him up? Yeah, they just left. I just wanted to thank you. Ethan needed today. Yeah, for sure. I mean, so did I, honestly. Honestly, by the end, I was having just as much fun as he was. <laughs> he thinks the world of you, you know. After everything, I think you're sort of his hero. Well, he's sort of mine. How creative he is. You must be so proud of him. He was so thrilled to see you show up with the sword. <laughs> I think that was mostly about the sword. No, don't shortchange Maybe. yourself here. But I think he was happy to see you in his world. <sighs> sorry. I'm sorry. I'm okay. Charlotte? God, Alex, don't mind me, okay? Just... A lot going on. Now is your time to open up and vent. You got a lot going on. I don't mind. I don't mind you. At all. Do you want to talk about it? You're really sweet, but I'm okay. Clearly. Thanks for swinging by. I'll see you at the festival. Are you sure? If you want company, no, she's gonna get, I'm she's gonna get upset. No! Fuck! Don't you listen? She's not. Shit. She's just lashing. She's upset. She's just lashing out. Here we go. All right, let's investigate a little bit and see what's going on. Where did that anger come from? What do you mean, where did it come from? She's got a lot of trauma she's dealing with right now. Oh wait, Steph, what did she say? Uh. Hero. Dude, thank you so much. You totally killed it. Award-winning bard material right there. You're pretty amazing, too. Oh, God. What did Ducky say? Oh, it's great. <laughs> I love it. Dear Alex, what a marvelous event. I'm so glad I could participate in today's live-action roleplay. It brings me back to my days in theater. Did I ever tell you that I once assayed the role of Falstaff in my school's production of The Merry Wives of Windsor? With enough liquor prodding, you may one day get me to recall a few verses. And thank you for including me in the festivities. Nice to take my mind off of things. Anyhow, you enjoy your very first spring festival. I can still remember mine clear as day. Sincerely, Reginald McAllister III. Oh, God, Ducky's a, Ducky's a gem. All right, let's dig into your emotions real quick. And she's got to be she lost her love it's got to be debilitating but it feels like the world's spinning and crumbling around her Something here that can tell me why. Let's get into it. Oh. Gabe, it's your fault. Why would you teach me to need someone again just to go and leave me all alone? Damn. 
damn. Oh, my bad. Alex, it's your fault. Everyone loves you. But I can't look at you without thinking about how fucked everything is since you came into my life. Her, but there's something else here. What is wrong with me? I can't let myself feel this way. When did I become such a fucking monster? Are you allowed to feel upset? Complex You're issues at now. At Ethan, you blame him. I'm a bad mom, Alex. No, Charlotte. <laughs> Charlotte. I hate my son, Alex. God damn. He's sweet and he's creative and he's the most important thing in the entire universe to me. And I hate him. For so long, it was just me and him. It took so long to learn how to be okay with that. And I was. But then, Kate. I can deal with hating Ryan, or you, or even Gabe, but Ethan, if he had just listened, Gabe would still be alive. It all comes back to that. What you're feeling makes more sense than you think. Your pain matters too. None of it fucking matters. He's dead. <sighs> I wish I were too. I'm getting nervous here. This anger could kill her and nothing I'm saying is helping. What if? I could just take it away. I don't think you can. Is she gonna try? Oh shit, don't. You can't just take emotion away like that. Oh fuck. I can do it. I can take her anger from her. I don't think I would do that if I were you. What would that do to her? What would it do to me? And even if I can, should I? No, I don't think, no, I don't think you should take her anger. Oh, fuck. I don't take Charlotte's anger, leave her. She needs to feel. I can't just take her feelings away and then, oh, no, but I don't want her to fucking destroy herself. Ah! <laughs> No, it's not, it's not, it wouldn't be natural to take her emotion away. No, no, no. My, my gut says leave her alone. I oh. can't. I'm sorry, Charlotte.
I gotta say something. You're strong. You'll get through this. I guess we'll find out. Mm -hmm. Fuck. My gut tells me that I, yeah, I don't know about this whole, like, taking someone's fucking emotion away. Like, I, no, I don't, I don't know about that. I, that doesn't, that doesn't scream, like, good vibes to me. I want to help, but that's, that's just something I don't think I can help with. Hear me out. Fuck, dude, it's I felt like, uh, oh boy. That would explain the conspicuously triangle-shaped logo. Boom. Finally cracked it. Uh. Hey. Howdy. Alex. So, how did things go with Charlotte? Not well. <sighs> I couldn't help her. I don't know. She was hurting so much. I thought I'd be able to help her, but I couldn't. If you couldn't help her, I'm sure no one could. She's working through a lot of shit right now. So... Please tell me that the USB stick revealed all of Typhon's secrets. Uh, not yet, but Alex, I don't like this. We found a recording of Gabe's call. Oh, I should probably listen to that. Oh, shit. Okay. I need to know. How did you find this? We're here for you. Okay? I don't like... No, you guys. What does the recording say? I don't like this. Why are you being so dour? Um. Wait. Oh, SMS. Ethan? Hey, Alex. It's Ethan. I'm really sorry about that. The LARP was amazing. Really. You are a badass. You have to apologize. I had so much fun with you. Have a great time with your dad and stay safe. Charlotte's saying... All right, so... Okay, cool. Wait, hang on. So, uh, so in this episode, this chapter so far, Diane's anger. Diane's guilt was fractured, stranded in the no man's land between sadness and fury, a place I couldn't reach. I had to nail it down in one place to the other where I could wrap my fingers around it. I used my own anger to draw hers out, stoked it, cultivated it. She was all about shaking with it. Oh, what? No. At all, all, oh, she was all but shaking with it. A typhon, sure, in the position they'd placed her in. But more than anything, I think, it herself. If I'm honest, I'm not sure how I feel about using this ability that way. Forcing someone into an emotional corner just to read them. But Typhon has us in a corner too, don't they? I keep thinking that she could have used that anger. Turned it into something instructive. Used it to bring these fuckers down and stop them from hurting anyone else. But she didn't, did she? She turtled up. Collected ammo to keep Typhon from coming for her. Fuck anyone else. Fuck anyone else who happens to cross them in the meantime, right? Whatever. I have what I need. Tell me more about the tolerable limits. Tell me more about integrity. Tell me what you've seen as you bury the bones. It goes, a target on your head keeps their sights off me. Then we had Ethan's joy. I guess I'm used to feeling like the whole world changes when I take on someone's emotions. But what Ethan's joy did to Haven, the way it lassoed the entire town and dragged it into his fantasy, I've never experienced anything like that. I actually felt Alex dissolve, slough off, and underneath was just Alwyn. It felt good to try on a different history, to remember a different life in a different world. But when the sirens came and Haven snapped back into focus, I don't think fantasy Alex could have done what I did. Ethan didn't need her. He needed me. That felt good. Mon uh, we can pry jewels from claws on your behalf, or we can wear masks and stalk the streets. Are we monster? Are we mortal? Whichever you need us to be. And then lastly, we have Charlotte's anger. That's... Uh, I, 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 I admire the um, the writers in the game for going for going that deep on it. Like, that's... That is some... Um, that's not... Anybody who would hear what Charlotte said might initially say that's just fucked up and that nobody should think that. But that's real. That's the fucking real emotion is that you start... When you're that angry and you've lost somebody like that, I mean, you could, that's, that's the thing. You could, you can grow to hate your own son, like love him. And he's still the brightest part of your world. But then like inadvertently, he also caused the death of the, of the man that you loved. I mean, that's, 
you can't help that's realistic to have those blames and all that. I think it was similar topics were broached in, uh, if you ever saw Babadook, uh, very similar between that mother and, and, uh, and her son, like that, that back and forth. Um, some anger blisters like old film stock stuck in a projector. It eats you up from the inside, melts away everything else until all you are is a brittle shell and a boiling mass of blame and guilt. Make some art. It's supposed to help, right? But it doesn't just fit, but it doesn't just fills your shop with reminders of what a shitty person you are. Don't know how I knew I could do it. It was like suddenly noticing an extra limb, somehow invisible until the very moment I thought to use it. I could reach inside, find Charlotte's anger, turn it down, turn it off. But I didn't. I could have, but I didn't. I didn't know what it would do to her, who she'd be after I took that pain away. It felt like such a violation. Hadn't she earned the right to be angry? That's, that's what I was thinking. Exactly what I was thinking. That was my biggest concern. I was so sure that I was helping people, that whatever else I am, I, I could at least offer this one thing to those who need it. But Charlotte's hurt is bigger than me, stronger. I have to hope that I can do more good by walking away than I could by meddling. I'm carving you out of stone. Finally learned how to need someone. Crack your coffin, penny for your thoughts. Oh, the fucking monster I've become. <sighs> All right, let's get into it. I I can't even get their feelings. What's the record? Is the chapter going to end on a recording and it's... Oh, God, what is this? It looks so down. Type in safety. Mac, it's me. Fuck off, Jen. Yeah, yeah, okay, just listen. I need you to call off the explosion. Ethan's in the blast radius. Shit. He could get killed. What the hell's wrong with you? He snuck off. We're, we're up here right now, trying to find him. Mac, please. All right. I'm on it. We'll halt the blasts. Fuck. You can't imagine the headaches this will create for me. Thanks, Mac. Whatever. Just doing my job. Yeah? They just ignored him. <sighs> it's so fucked. You know it's bad when Mac turns out to be the good guy. You okay? We're taking these fuckers down. <sighs> this USB stick oh. has what I need. Time to dig through it. Oh, I got a motion. Here we go. Whatever's going on with Typhon, it wasn't worth Gabe's life. Talk about looking for a needle in a haystack. Yeah. We're gonna get there. Don't worry. We're going to get them for you, Gabe. Mm. Ryan's pretty good at this detective stuff. He's a good man. We're gonna get them. Okay? Yeah, I know we will. Steph went all in so we could get our hands on this. <laughs> Let's hope it makes a difference. So, how fucked are we? <laughs> if we can't work it out ourselves, I could always just seduce the truth out of Diane. <laughs> oh, you really think so? It was working well earlier, uh, yeah. honestly. You saw me in action, right? Yeah, she was all flustered. Foosball trope. Gotta find joy in the little things. Right, Gabe? Who ordered fried rice and didn't get me some lo mein? A key part of any good investigation. Come on, that's just that's just selfish. A cold case and a warm beer. Ryan brought this down from his station. Hope it comes in handy. Mm. Typhon Pit. Tall drop off, rock slides common. 08 mine collapse, avalanche common, old refinery, old mill and processing. All right, all right. This time, I don't think Gabe would mind his little sister messing with his stuff. This Gabe's laptop? Thanks for spilling your guts. Okay. Gabe's call came in from the sat phone at 8.41 p.m. I should find the next call and see if that has any information. Hmm. Find out what happened after Gabe's call at 8.41 p.m. Okay. There's some earlier calls. 8.41, sat phone... 
<laughs> can I listen to the earlier calls? This is ACSD. How can we feed you? Is the good picking chicken thing still going on? It sure is. Nice. Uh, let me get a large order of the spicy nuggets. Nice. Excellent choice. And would you like the biscuit and gravy or the mashed potatoes and gravy? Biscuit and Oof. gravy. Uh, okay. I, uh, sir? Oh, fuck. Um, sorry. Do you, do you need a minute? <laughs> no. No, no. I'm, uh, gonna go with the bis- uh, potatoes. No, you should have gone with your gut, man. You could do both for 50 cents extra. Oh, my God. <laughs> still there? Yeah. No, um... Uh, no, that's okay. Just the potatoes. Okay. I've got you down for a large order of spicy nuggets nice. and potatoes. Quality That'll content. I'll be for you to pick up in about 30 minutes. Thanks. That was riveting. <laughs> All right. Mace Flowers, this is Riley. How can I help you? Hey, Bev, it's me. Mac, uh, hey, what's up? Oh, oh okay. Oh, this you're not going to believe what J-Man did this morning with some of the new diet. Hey, so I'm not sure about this part here. It's Mac. Is that Gabe? Hey, Mac? Can we talk later? I'm kind of busy. Busy how? Let's hang out when you get off, okay? Uh, Why is Gabe there? Okay. Talk soon. I love you. You should have just... Hey, Riley. You should have just... Oh, oh that... Man. That's why he got upset. Why didn't you just tell him he was work, helping you work on the thing? I mean, granted, she doesn't have to tell him every inch of her business, but I mean, that's how this whole... That's how the whole back and forth started. Hi, Belts Plumbing. How can I help you? Hi, I'm, uh... I'm a Typhon Mining. I think we had one of your plumbers up here last week. Typhon Mining. Uh, give me just one second to check our records. Yes, I have a record of a service call regarding some sewage backup. Yeah, yeah, that's... Yeah, so, um, I don't think it's fixed. The field report I have says that the issue was diagnosed and solved. Can you describe what you're seeing? I'm seeing shit! Oh, uh, you know, I, I really can't... Okay, you're a oh, miner, but you can't describe someone. feces? I'll have right. someone out to you later this afternoon. Great. Have a nice day. Yeah, I doubt it. Nasty. <laughs> All right, next day. Typhon Mining, this is Diane. Hi, Diane. It's Rose, down at Town Hall. Hey, Rose, how are you? Oh, I'm busy as a bee this time of year. You have a second? Some folks have come in here with some questions about the expansion and all that. I was hoping you could give me some answers to pass along to them. I'll do my best. What are the questions? Let's see here. Okay, first question. How many jobs do you expect to create by opening a second pit? We'll be starting with 25 new positions, but that number is expected to grow to 45 within the first year. Oh, give me just a moment here to jot that down. Alrighty, next up. A uh, number of questions regarding risks for pollution. Water, air quality, etc., etc. Anything you can offer there? You know, let me pass that on to our environmental outreach department. Mm -hmm. They'll get back to you with all the relevant fact and figures. Mm -hmm. Oh, sure, sure. No problem at all. And last one. They want to know if there will be more mining vehicles driving through town. Yes, we will be increasing our transportation needs somewhat with the expansion. But to minimize disturbance, we plan to direct drivers to stick to approved trucking routes. And of course, never after 6 o'clock. Never after 6. Thanks so much, Diane. That's all I have for you right now. My pleasure. Have a good one, Rose. You too. Diane is really good at pretending to be a person. Very corporate, yes. That's what I said earlier. Typhon Mining, this is Brandon. Hello. I'm calling from the Department of Land and Resources to confirm the inspection set for next week. Yeah, let me grab Diane for you. Thanks. This is Diane. Hi, Diane. I'm calling to... Confirm inspections? <laughs> yes. <laughs> did you have a chance to look over the email I sent? I did. Everything looks great. Glad to hear it. I'll see you Thursday then. Mm-hmm. Have a good one. You too. There must be a lot riding on these inspections. I'd imagine so. Okay, so we had the call that Gabe said that Gabe did to Max. So after that one, we have an outgoing on a Typhon HQ. Lena, it's Diane. We have a problem. You're kidding. There's a kid lost in the mountains near the pit. We need to postpone. Lena? Haven is your site, Diane, and therefore this is your decision. I know I don't need to remind you of the stakes. Someone could be hurt. Or killed. We've been over this. Anyone up there has disregarded posted notices and accepted full liability. Oof. We're talking about a child. I'm just asking for one day. If you postpone tonight's scheduled blast, you put Rhea in jeopardy. That puts the whole company in jeopardy. Is that what you want? Oh, my God. Yeah. Then do the math and make the right call. Yikes. Email me when it's done. I will. What the hell is Rhea? Must have been pretty damn important. Like, Maybe Diane says more about it in her email. Maybe. 
Let me see if I can find it. Hmm. Well, Hannah, what are the rest of the calls then? So we had the outgoing of Typhon HQ, and they pressured her to go ahead and continue with the blast. An incoming call the next morning from Alina Clark. Alina, hello, Diane. Is it safe to assume you've gotten your emotions under control? Excuse me? My emotions? Someone was killed last night because of a decision you made. I think... I would be very careful with what you say next. Oh, this lean is an actual what do you cunt. Think is more at risk here, me or you. Wow. <laughs> now, of course, we're all committed to helping you make it through this difficult period. We don't want to see anyone be scapegoated over an unavoidable <sighs> accident, right? <laughs> right. Great. Wow. Then you and I are aligned. Who else knew there were people in the mountains? Just my safety manager, Mac. He got their distress call just before I contacted you. Do you trust him? I... I think I can convince him to be trustworthy. Good. Good. Only one point of contact, and you've got him handled. I think we're going to make it through this just fine. Speak to you soon. Okay. See I refuse you. to feel bad for Diane and all this, but... Damn. Damn. Jeffrey... Jeffrey Bezos. Sorry, not related at all. Just getting certain vibes right now. Ongoing HB investigations... Less than an hour later. Agent B Investigations. Bennett speaking. Hi, Bennett. This is Diane Jacobs. Lena told me... Yep. Been expecting your call. Okay. I'm not sure what the next step is. Just need all the pertinent information on the employee in question. Name, number, address, significant other... Oh, wow. The they list. hired a private investigator to dig, dig up office. dirt on him? My secretary will take everything down. No records that you were Holy even there. Holy shit! Okay. A full corporate cover-up. Wow! It's so gross that Typhon has people watched. Damn. Later that same... Dude, they got busy. Typhon Mining, this is Diane. Hello, Diane. My name is Rory Praha. I'm a journalist Praha. from Rocky Mountain Gazette. We'll be printing a story on last night's accident in the paper tomorrow. Would you like to provide a comment? Yes, I would. Last night's accident was tragic and made all the more unfortunate by the fact that it could have been avoided with a simple phone call. Uh, a simple phone call. Can you speak more about that? Of course. Typhon always has a safety manager on duty. One quick call from Mr. Chen to our 24-hour... And then Matt got dragged into this? Shit. ...would have Shit. alerted us that there were people in the danger zone, and we could have reacted accordingly and stopped the blast. Damn. Are other Haven citizens in danger of meeting the same fate as Gabe Chen? Absolutely not. As long as you heed the warning signs, you will be safe. And if you ever do find yourself in an emergency, that's what our emergency line is for. There's no danger whatsoever. Mm. All right. We'll be sure to include your comments. Thanks for giving me your time, Diane. Have a nice day. Damn. I almost threw up listening to that. Same. Another call from the Sheriff's Department that afternoon. Typhon Mining, this is Diane. Diane, it's, uh, it's Jason. Hello, Deputy. You have good news for me? I suppose I do. You are officially cleared to continue regular operation. The county no longer considers your pit an active crime scene. Ooh, well, there's that's some contempt in that. Relief. Now, to be clear, the investigation is still open and active. Typhon hasn't been cleared of anything yet. Sure, I understand. But can we start mining again? Yes, you can start mining again. Is there anything else? Nope. No, that's it. Well, thanks for the call. Yeah, no problem. Take care, Diane. You too. Seems a lot easier to get away with murder than you'd hope. When you have the right amount of money and resources, you can ask you can get away with anything. Just ask fucking Brock Turner. Stick told of hiring? What? Oh, is she looking for different jobs? Wait now. Diane. Oh, hey, Joe. How are you? I'm good. Oh. Doing real good. So I have a pretty good list of candidates to go over with you. Looks like I've got forty names. Great work. When can we go over it? Uh, hey, Diane, can I be candid for a moment? Please. It's just, well, we've all been following the news, and I don't know, after that accident. Joe? I just want to be sure there really are positions waiting for these people. There's nothing to worry about. If you have qualified candidates to show me, I have jobs to offer them. Glad to hear it. You free Tuesday afternoon? Around three? Sure. Great. Looking forward to it. Hiring guy. See you later, Joe. I hope Typhon has a nice severance <sighs> package. Okay. Who is Rhea? What did the emails say? Oh, boy. Earliest one. Department of Who would have thought getting away with murder would be so... 
bureaucratic. 24th of morning to Jacob's Diane. Hello, Diane. I'm emailing to inform you that we've set a date for the inspections on your two sites. Please thoroughly review the info below. I'll give you a call in the next couple days to confirm the details. Decommission to coal shaft. We'll be going down in the closed shaft to ensure Typhon has taken proper precautions to stabilize the land post-collapse and that proper shaft closure procedure was followed. Act active uranium pit? This is a general protocol inspection. Please run business as usual on this day. Looking forward to meeting with you. Mm, okay. And then 25th. Too bad money can't fix all of Typhon's problems. From Dennis Walker to Diane Jacob. Sorry to hear about the troubles you're having with your hauler. I spoke with some folks about getting the brakes fixed, but given the upcoming expansion, I've decided to go ahead and buy you a new one. We'll send out, we'll send you out a 789 hauler. It should be efficient enough to handle two pits. The bat guys say they'll have it there next week. Okay. Let's see on the 30th from Senderlina Clark. Damn. Is this what Diane sold her soul for? Hello, Diane. Oh, that bitch Lena, yeah. Hello, Diane. After our recent conversation, I took the liberty of expediting your application to our executive training program. We will move forward with your enrollment as soon as you have the situation in Haven all ready. Oh, wow. So not only... Oh, hello. So not only was there, like, full-on... Oh, my God. So first she was pressured to not call it the explosion. Then, after the death, she was then further blackmailed. Not only... <laughs> like her and the manager on duty but like with her job and now they're basically like okay let me make sure this all things wrapped up covered up and good to go and we'll go ahead and get you that nice cushy executive position uh up there <laughs> jesus uh oh this is the email diane mentioned so what is raya sender diane jacobs to lena clark 28th and 9:42. i warned you lena i fucking warned you raya went off undetected as you insisted and now someone is dead. So wait, Rhea went off. So, dude, what is going on? So wait, they're not, hang on, whoa, 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 whoa. They're not, <laughs> not just doing blasting. There's something that caused an explosion. You better have a plan. I am not going down for this, at least not alone. Reply received 10.03 p.m. I understand that you're upset and emotional about tonight's tragic, unavoidable accident. Therefore, I am choosing to overlook this momentary lapse of judgment. I'll be calling first thing tomorrow to discuss how we move forward. I suggest you take the night to cool off. Oh, shit. All right, so some days later. This is, this is the latest one, then. Seems like a lot is hanging on these inspections. 5.06 at 10 a.m. to Diane from Dennis Walker. Hey, Diane, I wanted to congratulate you on your efforts in the Haven Springs expansion campaign. I just got word back from the state, and we've officially passed inspections. Pop some champagne. You've earned it. All that's left now is the vote. I've been hearing great things about your progress with the town members. Sponsoring the Spring Festival was a nice touch. Keep up the great work. We're on the home stretch, Dennis. Hmm. Diane called HQ to discuss something called Rhea. Wait, there's a call? Called HQ. Oh, was that it right there? After the... Wait, what is, or is that it? Oh, my bad. Email archive, that's all the emails. Well, I already did the Typhon HQ. Do I have to re-listen to it? Lena, it's Diane. We have a problem. You're kidding. There's a kid lost in the mountain. No, we already heard we that one. Pit. We need to postpone. <laughs> Lena? Haven is your site, Diane, and therefore this is your decision. What is Rhea? Those are the only emails there are. I listen to all the calls. Something I'm missing? So I have Seems to like... like a lot is hanging on these inspections. Oh, I should be clicking on those things. Who would have thought getting away with murder would be so... Bureau. The timing of all this is too convenient to be a coincidence. Okay, and then post-collapse. And I thought above-ground mining was terrifying. I didn't realize it wanted me to actually like click the highlighted bits. Too bad money can't fix all of Typhon's problems. Wait... Does this mean someone at Typhon feels actual human emotion? No. Not buying it. Upcoming expansion. He's talking about it like it's a sure thing. Damn. Is this what Diane sold her soul for? What a polite way of saying, I control you and don't forget it. Situation? You mean that guy you killed? Exactly. This is the email Diane mentioned. Okay, here we go. So what is Rhea? Rhea, Rhea went, went off, off undetected. Was there a second blast that night? 
they only had permits for one. What do we remember? What did Lena say? Without the scheduled blast, Rhea would be discovered. The fuck is Rhea? Shit. The blast that killed Gabe was just a cover for another explosion? We didn't hear another explosion, though. It must have gone off somewhere else. Mm. If we can find out where it was, that might tell us what it was for. Mm. Where was the second blast? Oh, file browser. Well, hang on, what was left in Damn. the emails? A second blast. He had a name and a life and a girlfriend and a sister. I bet this is when Diane decided to start copying evidence to this USB stick. Oh yeah, for sure. Wow, that's a funny way to spell criminal negligence. LOL. Seems like a lot is hanging on these whatever Typhon was up to. It looks like they've all but gotten away with it. Of course that was Diane's idea. Yeah. She's our corporate marketing department. I'm going to make sure this expansion fails if it's the last thing I do. Okay, file browser. Where was the second blast? Uh, council dossiers. Diane has dossiers on the entire Haven Council. That's not creepy at all. Eleanor Laith, council member since 98, owner of Laith Flowers, vote status probable, pressure points, granddaughter's student loans, medical expenses. Typhon knows about Eleanor's dementia. Oh my god. Shit. She got all the dirt. A native to Haven Springs, Eleanor Laith is well respected by council members and citizens alike. She holds considerable sway, but is unlikely to descend on her own. Though her granddaughter was close to Gabe Chen, she appears not to question Typhon's account of the accident. We have Jedediah Lucan. Yeah, Jed. Council member since 08. Council chair since 2012. Business owner of the Black Lantern. Vote status is secured. It won't be so secure once we tell Jed what really happened that night. Oh, I hope nothing happens to Jed if he gets wrapped up in this. Pressure points, none available. Jed is viewed as a local hero due to his rescue of 19 hell divers during a collapse in 08. Strong ally. Use him as a resource to secure other council members' votes if necessary. Charlotte Harmon. Business council member since 2016. Business owner of the Silver Dragon Dispensary. Vote status unknown. Pressure points, business overhead, son's college savings. A well-known small business owner in Haven, Charlotte will prove instrumental to getting the buy-in of both other business owners and a 20 to 35 demographic, demographic. As Gabe Chen's girlfriend, she may be a lost cause. Corporate approved making a financial offer. You'll receive the details soon. I knew that affidavit gave me a bad feeling. Good, that's what I thought. McAllister Reginald III, Ducky. Council member since 01. Boat status, probable. Pressure points, grief over deceased wife. Poor Ducky. I didn't know. I think it's something like that. A strange relationship with daughter. We've been able to dig up very little about Ducky's past, but we do know that he arrived in Haven shortly after resigning from the board of his own company due to a falling out with his daughter. Ducky has voted with Jed in every prior instance, making his vote all but secured. We have Jason Pike. Council member since 03. Vote status unknown. Pressure points, career as sheriff's deputy, seems to have a crush on, seems to have a crush on you, Jason. Oh, seems to have a crush on you. What? Pike has a, okay, bigger fish to fry right now. Seems to have a crush on you. Jason Pike has been a sheriff's deputy in Haven for over eight years. He and the company have skirmished over small violations in the past, but we see no evidence that he harbors anti-Typhon sentiment. Double down on Typhon's commitment to the community. That's likely your best angle. That's everybody. Shit. Rhea schematic? This is Rhea. Fuck. This map's too small to tell where this is. So... I need a map. Oh, shit. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Um, search? That's the site of the 2008 Typhon mine collapse. Oh! Wait. Everything's they connected! They a blast in their current mine to cover up a blast in their old mine? That shaft was exhausted years ago. There's nothing left to dig up. What could possibly be down there that's so important? It's got to be a resource of something. Typhon just had to pass a bunch of inspections at the old site, didn't they? Yeah, so? So, oh, burying I don't something. think they were digging something up. Oh, we finished it. They were burying something. Shit, shut up. Look at the other files first. Ah, oh, God damn it. But I should have. 
No, I missed the other files? Fuck! I, I, I should have looked at everything else first. Oh, boy. Huh. Oh! Oh, wow. Alex chose Steph to distract Diane. Most people did. Ooh. Alex took Charlotte's anger from her. A little over half did. I left her. Ooh, but was it good or bad what I did? Most people took it. Holy shit. I didn't think that would have been... I didn't know I'd be in the slight minority. Alex made Diane sad. Alex made Diane angry. What? Wait, how? how? Wait, there was only... I could have just made her sad? I didn't mean to make her mad. Oh, no. Wait, hey, no, wait, no. Diane... No, I'm thinking of the other girl. Wait. Oh, okay, yes. I made her angry instead. I didn't know I could make her sad instead. I guess I should have, but I figured... She said get her riled up. Alex didn't play a record. Oh, yeah, well, I mean, I just... Just music, so... I don't want to... I just copyright. Half and half did some weeding. I mean, yeah, in the grand scheme of things, it didn't seem to matter too much. Ethan and Alex were never knocked out in battle. Hell yeah. <laughs> nice. The troll was killed, was subdued with magic powder, took Alex's bribe. Ah, uh, see if I... I should have gone to the record shop first. I thought I was going to. The serpent was put to sleep. Nice. Steph helped Alex find out what Typhon was up to. Why would she have stormed out? Keen Tabor was vanquished in the final battle. Everybody took out the Keen Tabor. Wait, Riley found out about Eleanor's dementia? How could she have found out? Wait, I, I would have... How would she have been able to find out? Alex helped the student focus on her work. Well, that's nice. Alex and Ethan solved the Jester's riddle. Alex and Ethan helped the blacksmith out. Okay. Well, shit. Okay, we're over halfway there. Damn. Developments for sure. Interesting ones at that. So, we figured out the call was made to Mac successfully. Mac did pass the lawn successfully. But when Diane was supposed to get the, the call in, she was basically pressured and then inevitably blackmailed by Lena and uh, like higher-ups in Typhon to let the blast carry out. But... In addition to that, it's not just the blast, there's apparently also this thing, Rhea. I don't know if Rhea is a place or a thing or what, but the explosions are a cover of whatever this Project Rhea is, so I should have read those other folders first though before I moved on, and I'm, I'm a little bit nervous, honestly. Um, I still feel good about my decision. I decided not to take away her anger. I, I don't think that would have been the right thing to do. Um, I mean, I don't know what... The, I don't think you should, like, deprive... So, I don't think you should, like... People need to experience emotions and figure their own way out through it. You shouldn't be able to just take someone's sadness or anger. I don't know about that. Um, but, yeah, I'm a bit nervous as to what she's going to do next and how that's going to progress. So, there's that. Um, but, yeah, uh, I, I don't know what's going to happen in the next chapter, honestly. Will it show me what the chapter's called? Ice, A-side, lanterns, monsters, or mortal... I only found... Man, I sucked at finding memories in this one. Jesus, I I only found one. I thought I was looking everywhere. Uh, but yeah, that was chapter three of Life is Strange True Colors. I'm going to end the stream there. About three hours, so... That's usually what each chapter is like. Chapter one was the longest for sure, but chapter one typically always is in these games. So yeah, uh, fun times as always. Stay tuned for the next stream where we go on to chapter four. We're already, like I said, halfway through, but I'm really enjoying this. Um... The, uh, the story is always... You know, the game always surprises me with how good the story ends up being. And uh, just the right amount of interactivity and, like, crucial choices. But also, like, fun. And it's got a good balance between moments of levity and the serious moments. And in this case, the, the humor and also the trauma of the characters. So, um, I like that for sure. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Stay tuned for the next stream slash episode of... True Colors, and goodbye, travelers.